Okay. You don't, do you? No, I do. I know exactly what you mean. Okay, okay we're good to go. Good morning, everyone. I'm just going for that. Yeah, good morning. <laughs> so, right, so sorry we kind of gone pretty early. But I'm really sorry that we're early. <laughs> really? Yeah, you don't get that off most streams, do you? But, uh, yeah, we noticed that um, one of our first streams had issues with the signal down here yesterday. We've so, had issues the last couple of times. And we've times. had big issues when we've been booting up from this location lately. So we thought, get here early, boot up, see how we go. And, like, the numbers are so good, I just went, let's not jinx it, let's just go. Yes. So uh, we're a few minutes early. It's worse issues to have, aren't there? Exactly. But, uh, yeah, good morning, everyone. Hope you're all doing well. Some people are going to have a rude awakening in a minute when they see that we've gone live. Oh, no, you're alive. <laughs> well, hey, better. Better early, I guess. There we go. Brian, good morning. David, good morning. John, good morning. Hope you're doing well today. Yeah. Good morning, Lennon. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Paul. Good morning, Ashton. Good morning, Stuart. And good morning, David. Ah, look at that, I'm up to date with the chat. Wow. Ah, should go live early more often. That doesn't happen often, does it? All right. Well, they've not even opened runway two yet. That's how... Uh, that's how efficient we are. That's how efficient we are. That's where we are. But, uh, right, to be honest, could be worth. We've got the Etihad about to turn on to finals, so... So we're going to get that. Yeah, we've also got the Qatar, uh, just over the Peak District. So we're just not going to miss anything today. On it. On it. Good morning, Ian. Good morning, Albert. Look at all the easy jet tails now. One has actually gone from this stack that I'm looking at now. Wow. Uh, when we turned up, there was like, it was just a full stack. But like you can tell from uh, the initial shot, we have had a couple kind of uh, go down in the taxi. And another one that's pushed. Good. Well, good afternoon to you, Rob. I'm from Australia. Uh, your mum, good morning. There we go. Here's our first departure. Enjoy, everyone. Twenty heading off to Marrakesh. Uh, took an early uh, entry onto the runway there by the looks of it, so I'm assuming, not that, I'm assuming not that busy on there. I just realised I went straight in with the 600 millimetre pan. I'm just like, <laughs> yeah, I don't need that anxiety first thing in the morning. Oh. Uh, good morning, Claire. Saying uh, up early to go uh, to Manchester Airport, spotting for a few hours. Yay! That is what we like to hear. Get your geek on, people. I can't see that one that you say come on early. Oh, it's that one. The one that just left. Oh, that one. Yeah. Oh, it looked like it took full length. Oh, it looked like it took... It went on early on the thingy. Could be wrong. I'm not used to two threes anymore. Okay, so we've got our first EasyJet coming over that's been, well, given permission to take off on this runway. Oh, they're they early as well. Yeah, no, I think <laughs> they're going to... That's in, like, airfield. That's in, like... Big planes have gone live. Go open runway two. Go That's why we love that. That's why we love that. Uh, team here at Manchester. They are legends. Uh, I think they're going to have to wait a few minutes though. Yeah. All honesty, but see so, uh, our next departure is now lining up. 
I don't know, as you can see, the tail to the left oh, of the Andrew's winter. Andrew's also coming down today. He's going to the pub, but I've got a three-hour drive first, but that hey. will all be worth it. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Jax, good morning. Uh, Mike D, good morning. Good morning, Eddie. So cheerful. I was having a power nap in the car before we walked up here. Daryl, good morning. Caleb, seven three seven back off to Amsterdam. No, he went on to the same place as EasyJet, so it's just me not being used to where they're turning on down there anymore. Yeah, it's definitely down the bottom. Um, also, because of the map mode I have, and I can't see any of your taxiways, so what are you going to do? Okay, well, I think everything else is going to be coming off this runway now. I don't think there's anything else down there. Well, this is EasyJet A320 after Gibraltar. With our jib flights. Yeah, uh, you've got the uh, FCA just approaching Stockport. Okay, well, I think... Triple seven this morning. In the new livery. In the new so livery. I've checked already. So you have. Where's what is that? Thankfully, he won't rear his, uh, his head for a while yet. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Maggie. Good morning, John. Here we go. Well, good morning, Gemma. Uh, sorry about a bad night's sleep, but hopefully we can keep you company this morning and make it all better. And a brew sounds good. <laughs> hopefully you might have time to get a power nap in later. Right, I'm guessing that Etel's going to be quite close now. It'll be, uh, Gary, good morning. And Josh, good morning to you too. Uh, just a passing Cheadle, approaching Heel Green. Right, yeah. Well, this EasyJet is not messing around. It's uh, a this decent old lick they've got on this taxi. Every 20 Neo off to Pisa. Turn and burn, everyone. How to uh, kick your tripod. It's the uh, SCL arriving from Abu Dhabi. Sorry about the vicious uh, swing on that pan, but that's life. I did try and warn him a little bit earlier just to be like... Well, usually you do it and like the app hit like heel green then and I'm just like going, okay. Oh, no, 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 I, I saw I got, this. Like, I, got, like, I got like 20 seconds before I need to jump over on that one. I was just like, no, it is literally just hit the threshold of the car park and uh, needs me to jump on it. Yes. Okay, I'm going to have to re-level my drive out after that one. <laughs> Fun times. Good morning, Bev. Uh, cafe spot a good morning. We're in uh, Northern California, so thank you for staying up late. Paula, good morning. Good morning, how are you? And it was great, great to meet you. Oh, it was, it really was. And, uh, we're looking for some suitcases. Still, still looking. Still looking. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, it was lovely to meet you. Right, you're going to have to bear me one minute. I am just going to re-level my tripod because nothing in life is worse than a tripod that is not level. Give 
Ryanair 737 MAX 8 going to Limoges and uh, Qatar has just turned on to finals excellent Currently have an Air France uh, A320 crossing the runway Uh, Imo, yeah, absolutely. Go, go to uh, go to Helsinki Airport. Go do some plane spotting. It's a plane spotting kind of day. A320 heading back to Paris. Guitar's past Cheadle. I'm going to get into this Ryanair's grill first. Sorry? I'm going to get in the Ryanair grill. Oh, sounds like a good idea. Right in their grill. Right, right now I never like to wave. I have noticed that, I won't lie. Qatar is passing Hill Green. Okay, cool, I'll get this. Because they haven't waved, I will be concentrating on that one. Bitter, <laughs> bitter sigh. Yeah, that was a rubbish turn. Yeah, you're going to need to go there. Up. Morning, mate. You okay? Qatar. Yep, got you. Okay, morning. Nice little bit of flex. So a dreamliner this morning. Sorry to hear about uh, Tommy. Hopefully he's feeling better soon. I, I don't even want to imagine how tired you must be feeling right now. But uh, hopefully we can make the morning a little bit better. Yeah, I second that. Uh, Bong Bing, Jim is in the chat. Bong Bing to and you, sir. Thank you, Jim, for the uh, 4 99 hype. Tripe. Super sticker that we managed to see yesterday. Pablo, see Francis. Uh, good morning. Morning, Josh. Ah, uh, morning, Matt. Glad to hear that it's a work from home day today. 
Oh. That is what we like to hear. Morning, Bert. Good morning, Jonathan. Yeah, it's a Malay book morning. Morning, Karen. Hope you're well. Ooh, Tintin's coming down here. Nice. They love sending that thing here. Uh, I got. A, I. I <coughs> Thank you to the lovely people at Nats this morning for uh, sending so many planes down this uh, taxiway. Can't beat it. Right, I won't like, I am not going to fully get this um, Ryanair because I want the Tintin after it. Sorry, Ryanair. Oh, it is, exactly. Uh, good morning, Jeff. Good morning, Anthony. Nice looking Ryanair, though. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a little bit bonkers. We're having quite a few planes come on right in front of us. I will take that. Um, okay. <laughs> I thought so. I thought that's what you were saying, so it's double check. <laughs> morning, Gary. Good morning, like the fires, kick the toes. Oh, yeah, okay, so lots of coffee. It is an order, it is a thing for It is a order. coffee, coffee day today. I will say that. Uh, Charlie, thank you for being a member for two months. Saying uh, good streams as always. Uh, keep up the good work. Thank you. Hang on, I'll wait till this to go. <laughs> I was back off to uh, Brussels but uh, yeah thank you so much Charlie for the uh, continuing support absolutely amazing yeah thank you so much mate I get the thank yous in in the end between recordings and Ryanair one sec yeah I'll get another one here I'm sure you'll agree that livery looked amazing especially if we zoom right in on Tintin himself with its snowy action exactly if you've got 4k you can do that so well well I think if, you, if you're looking at the crop right now you can actually see us going right in on the flight deck there I mean, they've go. been given permission to take off good morning Holly Sarah good morning happy hump day to you too
that I think uh, most of them give us a good stare. They're either thinking, oh, it's Think Planes, or they're like, what on earth are they doing out at this hour of the day? Uh, Liars Neil, good morning. Another one staying up late over in California. Oh, I hope you're enjoying this extreme close up action here in Manchester. And uh, we got a wave there. Awesome. Uh, this is Jets off to Malta. It's an A319. Very nice captain there. Thank you for that. And yes, you are on TV, so uh, thank you for that. <laughs> <laughs> you are on TV. Please give us a wave. <laughs> uh, he's already done that, so uh, we're good oh, with I'll that. I'll take that. <laughs> uh, I, just, I just love this taxiway today. I'm loving this taxiway too. Wishing nice. you all the best shots, everybody. It's nice to have so much traffic come down here, to be honest. It's, it's refreshing, you know, like... When we came down, when we were here through COVID and stuff like that, and you were here, weren't you? Yeah, yeah. Um, there was just no traffic. We had, like, three planes in, like, like six hours at certain times and stuff like that. Yeah. So, it's come it down It feels like what? how it should be. This is how it should be. It feels so good. Fire pit size, very nice. Hope you have a lovely time up there. I've been to Scotland for ages. Mike Wild, good morning to you. Are you well? Okay, so we're going to have a two departing next. We'll jump onto that as soon as we can. I can't even I'm sorry I'm just trying to think I'm trying to remember what all the Brussels special liveries are and I can barely there's tins we've got in, another one in later okay. Tomorrowland livery uh, yeah there's Tomorrowland the Smurfs you've got, got the Red Devils Red Devils and you've got the Belgian Alca, uh, Belgian That's icons the one, yeah good morning Matthew good morning Wendy Ryanair coming in front of us they love this in your face action <laughs> so we're going to jump onto that it's epic up close action here at Manchester today this I is know. next level we have it good here like all the time but this is something else that we've got today it's Ryanair's heading out to Brussels it's a 737 fake Brussels fake Brussels yeah. fake Brussels Brussels Charleroi Chasing Tintin, but not really chasing Tintin. Yeah. To be honest, Keith, I think I, I do. I think I feel like a lot of people kind of at least know that we're probably filming, if not already know who we are, just because Simon knows everybody. <laughs> Martin. Oh wow, that was early. And uh, Ian, I I don't know if he's woken up today yet, but uh, I know Paul made it back after his uh, six flights in two days, and 
I think he was a bit tired yesterday, but he made it. Yeah, um, I don't know how you did that, mate. Absolutely bonkers, but good he's on not you. Even it, it, well, he's not here yet. Oh, I thought he was, sorry. Yeah, I, no, I no, no, Ian Brown was just asking after him. All oh, right, got yeah. Um, but yeah, he did a cracking job. We'll, we'll go, he'll be in at some point, I imagine. He will be. Uh, Daryl, thank you so much for the uh, 8 dollars uh, New Zealand, not Australian. I'm really sorry. New Zealand. <laughs> Take it back if you need to. <laughs> Dollars. Thank you. Um, uh, what is the strangest thing you have seen whilst live streaming? What's the best thing? Strangest. Look at guitar landing. <laughs> oh, yeah, the wibbly wobbly guitar landing. Yeah. That was. Uh, we got a new emoji as well today. Oh, yeah, we got a new emoji. Heading off to Belfast. Next up will be a Ryanair 737 going to Mercia. And uh, coming up behind that is an EasyJet A320 Neo going to be going to Lanzarote. I think also with that as well was the Heathrow Winter Show. Yeah, that was. Just uh, how crazy it got there in a short period of time. And then, like, we're going, oh, the A380s can't uh, land here. And then the ATR came in and absolutely butted it. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, oh, yeah, that's probably another one. Uh, but pretty, yeah, thank you so much, Carol. Really appreciate that. And uh, I hope that somewhat answered your question. Good morning, Emma's. Condensation coming off that wing. Uh, Matt, how did you find uh, a Brussels? I will admit, I've uh, I've flown out of there, not uh, to the UK. I, fl- I think I flew from there to like I think it was Nice. Uh, Sorry, not take advantage of this up close action. Like going, who are those weirdos over there? <laughs> Morning, Dean. Dino. It's uh, easy A320 Neo is the one for Lanzarote. I forgot, I've already gone through all these, haven't I? So I can go back. And just, just to say, because we, we've got the lovely easy jet in there and we've got the lovely tower above. Thank you to you amazing people up there who are making this show so amazing. I know you're probably doing it without knowing it, but we're still saying thank you anyway. So thank you, you lovely, lovely people. Thank you so much. Absolutely amazing. I'm sure everyone in the chat will be showing some uh, tower remotes for that one because they are doing an amazing job. Let's be honest, there's a lot of flights going out in a very short space of time here and it's been handled amazingly well. Yeah. Well, you also have to deal with what's coming in. Well, exactly. I mean, I know there's been a little bit of a break of arrivals, but... OK, we're going to jump on the Ryanair. now. Because uh, we do like these shots. Well, I do anyway, and <laughs> I'm on the camera. Ah, uh, here we go. To be fair, uh, to be fair, to be fair, Ryanair are the ones that usually get stuff down very well. <laughs> What a legend. There we go. Thank you, Captain. Uh, Michael, good afternoon to you over in Melbourne.
think uh, Ryanair, who uh, follow me on Instagram, will love that reel. So I uh, <laughs> can't wait to put that one up. George, good morning. Nice little cheeky wave. Ah, and it's gone so quiet now. Woo, and breathe, everybody. I hope you enjoyed that, because that was intense. I mean, we've only got like another good, about two minutes before we get our next one on here, but you know what I mean. But yeah, thank you to those lovely people at Nats today. <laughs> I say, probably don't even know that they're doing it, but hey, I'll take still it. Say thank I you. will take it, exactly. Uh, da, 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 where was I? Uh, Suzanne, good morning. How are you well? Ooh, have they changed the maps on flight radar? Oh, I don't know, I haven't seen anything. I oh, know they haven't, no, mine's just taking ages to okay. update. Uh, Mike, a wild member for three months saying I keep up the excellent streaming. Oh, thank well you. done. Well, thank you so much. Thanks for the continued support. Yeah, it's great to have you on board with Absolutely us. Absolutely amazing. Was that a pun? Was that a plain pun? Great to have you on board. I was doing that all the time. All oh, right, okay. I just heard it today. <laughs> I was just like, this is what this is what I do. I come out with the plain type puns and everything, and it's uh, everyone loves it. Fair enough. Uh, Paul show, good morning. Uh, Beastie with the two pound super chat saying uh, good morning, Liz and Simon. Si- Silent? Silent? Silent. That's <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Happy streaming. I've been called worst, I'll tell you now. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. We even really though I can't even say Simon's name anymore, uh, I do really appreciate it. Oh, I feel like I can breathe for a minute. So I think, you know, like I have the 600 millimetre pan. Yeah. Thing. It's been thrown out the window now. It's 900 millimetre. I'm glad I did the emoji. <laughs> uh, fun. Just make another one when we get another one. Yeah, I think that's probably going to be easier, to be honest. Oh, John, thank you so much for the 20 gifted memberships. Oh, John, thank you, mate. Absolutely. Outstanding. Thank Hope you so you, much. Hope uh, you've got everything that you need to do with your friend um, early in the week. But uh, amazing to have your support. Yeah, we do appreciate absolutely. it. It's amazing. Oh, we do have a plane landing. Oh. I didn't even see it on flight radar, so that it's not you. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, it's a bitch jet. All right, that'll be why then. All oh, right, Matt, okay, now I understand. Okay, well, I can't really recommend the fake Brussels. I mean, it worked for me because it was actually closer for me, so it wasn't too far for me to drive there. And I live in Germany, but... Um, I've heard a few people moan about it. Yeah, like, and like I say, I was going from there to Nice, so it was like, uh, by the by, really, but... Um, do you actually want to go to Brussels and just be prepared for some public transport? Trek. Yeah. Looking up over an hour, put it that way. Yeah, I think it's about an hour and a half, wasn't it? Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, some nice light on that. All right, okay. I wasn't expecting you to say that, but all right. I can see a bit of sunlight through yeah, the trees, there is. to be fair. Uh, it might burn this cloud off, to be honest, so that we could be in for a bit of a treat. Crossed. Uh, Andy Taylor, a bit of ever for two months. Yes. So, you know, good morning, everyone. Uh, great fun as always. Well, thank you so much, and thank you for uh, renewing and uh, supporting us as a channel. We do Absolutely. really appreciate it. Right, so let's turn and burn on this Ryanair. Oh, thanks, Davis. An absolutely magical shot, guys. Well done. Well done. I've lost the ability to speak. Seven three seven max eight down heading down to Genoa. And we got that gear up. Great job. And good morning, Miles. Hope you're well. Thinking so um, today when we were well we've known for the last couple of days that the winds are going to be an absolute nightmare for um, ATC and we're just hoping that for, uh, for their sake 
to be honest, uh, that the wind stayed down because between 7 and 8, we're supposed to switch to... Well, this is what the uh, the Met Office and another couple of apps are saying, that we should be switching to 05s, which, as you can understand, that probably the busiest times of the day would be an absolute nightmare for, yes. them for changing the, um, the stacks and the approaches. So hopefully if it stays under five to six knots, they, sh- they shouldn't have to do that. We could just stay on two threes because it will switch back again l- a little bit later in the morning. Yeah, it says a lot of faffing around, doesn't it? Well, we and I'm str- sure that's the official term. Like We don't want to faff around. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we, um, yeah, because we were in a bit of a dilemma of where to actually stream yeah. from today, weren't we? So uh, well, We thought we'd come here. I was felt- both saying, uh, wow, glad I woke up. Uh, woke up. Um, Nice nerve. Uh, yeah, very yeah, early. Yeah, well yeah. worth it, absolutely. No, absolutely. Oh, when they say if you're looking for some sunshine, <coughs> we have it here. Do we have a bit of sunshine? We do have a bit. I'd like a bit more. So if you could send a bit this way. Yeah, there's a bit on the... Um, to the right of us. A bit more to the oh, right of us than there is okay. to the left. Fingers crossed it comes out more. Exactly. And uh, Jonathan, a new member, thank you so much for signing up for Short Haul. Oh, brilliant. That is amazing. That. I don't want to take, you know, I, I think we have to give some credit to uh, ATC, like you say. Is that oh, Jonathan probably... Earnshaw? Jonathan. Yes. Yeah, so John, Jonathan, just great to see that you got it. John sent us a message yesterday on Twitter just uh, asking about, um, did he have to wait for his uh, gifted membership to run out before he had to become a member? Oh, right, okay, yep, so, yep, yep, right. So uh, it's great that you were able to do that, and thanks Amazing. for messaging us. And Thank you uh, so much. It's brilliant that you've been able to do that. So, awesome. Nice uh, Kyle, good morning. I'm not going to jump in on the uh, private hangar too much. I think they'd uh, really thank me for that. Uh, it gives a very good morning. Have you well today? Oh, really? Uh, Mark saying, uh, I noticed where fake Paris is yesterday. It's halfway from Paris to the north coast of France. Yes. Yeah, wow. There are de- the one thing there are, there are decent connections there. They just take a while. Yeah. That's, that's what I will say. The about moderator it. is in the chat. The moderator. What a legend. And, and I'm so happy he wasn't here for the Etihad arriving this morning. And tuned uh, in rail action. Thank you for signing up as a new member. Oh, that's fantastic. Welcome to domestic. Thank you so much. Absolutely amazing. Just to say, you have the use of our fantastic emotes. We love them. Um, and you also get access to the Think Plains Clubhouse on Facebook. Uh, all you have to do is go uh, go on Facebook, look for Think Planes Clubhouse. That's quite self-explanatory, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Even for me, I think I can get that one. And then um, after that, all you have to do is uh, put your YouTube username in there so we can cross-reference you to see that you're a member and do that, and then we can welcome you in That's there. That's for gifted memberships as well. as that, Exactly, uh, yeah. That's a really um, good point. Thanks. Yeah. And uh, uh, Martin Haywood, thank you also for joining. Welcome to Domestic as well. I was hoping to get that in before Simon did his little spiel there. But, hey how we got it in the middle. So, thank you so much. Really appreciate that. Sorry. But thank you. Um, absolutely amazing support. We love it. So, yeah. If all you can ever do is press that like button, that's all we ever want. That's it. Just enjoy it and press the like. Flight radar just broke. There's a two that was coming round the back. That was the one from Melbourne. Okay, I'm going to just close the app and restart it because that should be on fine as well, to be honest. See it. You're all right. Okay, that's good. Uh... Right. We'll zoom out a little bit because I'm going to have to pan from one to the other air, I think.
and uh, Ian B just sent you a message I uh, hope you're feeling better soon but uh, hopefully we can make things a little brighter for you this morning it's one of those epic action um, it, uh, Stephanie the time currently is 6.47am Morning, did you see? Hope you're well. Yeah, uh, great to have you in as uh, one of our new mods. <laughs> Matthew saying uh, Simon's gone from a 600 millimetre pan to a 900 millimetre pan, and he's slowly working his way up to Hubble pan. <laughs> yeah, do you know it's it's a it's a goal of mine. I won't lie. Get my mum and dad's telescope down here. That if you whack a camera on that, I don't think I'm panning that. After I was going to say, it's like, I think it's like, is it like twelve? Oh, no, more. I think it was like nineteen hundred yeah, millimeters it is, or something. That. It works out at. I remember my dad telling me once. But this way, I'd be able to tell you what the pilots had for breakfast. You know what I mean? If you have <laughs> that kind of stuff. Okay, I'm having uh, real issues with flight radar. Yeah, no, I found mine really slow to boot up today, so I, I'm, I am guessing it's a flight radar issue. I mean, there's stuff showing. It's like it just doesn't want to show Manchester. That's quite rude. Oh, okay. That's weird. I had problems with the maps, as you could probably tell when I said. As yeah, the map them, yeah. Okay, well, we'll have to go back to that in a minute. You might have to keep an eye on yours, to be honest. Yeah, I will do. Uh, I'll have to see what else I've got. Yeah. There's Wally the Windsock. As you can see, <laughs> um, dare we say, I mean, it's the, the, the well under the limit, aren't they, in regards of winds at the moment, but we're really probably looking at 05s at the moment. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, good morning, Roy. Hope you're well. Great to have you in the chat as always. Oh, God, my, my, my voice then. Let's have you. Oh, it went up like two octaves or something there. That's ridiculous. Like I became a choir boy for two seconds. <laughs> Easy. Bet you've not uh, had your voice that high pitched for a long time. Oh no, seriously. <laughs> That's weird. You have flashbacks to being like a child. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, Matt, I don't think we can trust the BBC, I won't lie. They say one thing, it does the opposite. Well, they're kind of right at the moment. Well, okay, yeah, they are. Well, you said, well, Matt just said it's a down, going down as a crosswind. Oh, uh, yeah, on the app. It, it probably is, effectively, but, you know, the windsock doesn't do crosswinds, does it? It just tells you where it actually is at the moment. Yeah. But the thing is, it's not strong enough to actually turn it. So, as you say, it's yeah. probably, it's probably like doing variable on, on like, flight, flight radar, so. Ah, uh, Gene didn't know. Well, I, so thank you so much for saying this is a quite easily the best live aircraft footage I've come across. Oh, uh, the bounce of the close-ups, the cracking sounds from the engines, uh, and so much more. Well, thank you. Oh, we do appreciate you that. We really do. That was very kind of you to say that. Okay, so what I'm going to say to you is, go and get yourself a coffee. I think you deserve it if you're up at this time. If you're up a little bit later, maybe yeah. wanting to think about having something a little bit more adulty. Well, it depends where you are in the world. That's what I'm saying. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, you know. Um... Um, oh, but yeah, Gina, yeah, we do, uh, we, we get our fair share of props. I think there's some sort of special ATR coming yeah, later, apparently. Yeah, we do. We have... Uh... Never thought you'd hear us say that, a special ATR. <laughs> well, yeah, because we were thinking of maybe doing a short show today, but I think we'll probably go a little bit longer for that. I do want that one. I did say that, didn't I? You did want it. Um, so, it is, because I've forgotten, I won't lie, I'm really bad, um... Yeah, it's um, oh, it's the BRA, it. and we've got it, and it's coming in from uh, Starvenger, uh, so we'll take it. I'll, yeah. I'll have that. So uh, yeah, we look forward to that, and it probably means we get the second Emirates as well. Bev uh, pressed the like button last night. No messing. I noticed in the chat this morning that there was quite a bit of banter about the likes because uh, <laughs> we, we, we were here a bit early because, like I say, we uh, we noticed that the internet has been a bit dodgy here of late. So we thought, let's get here a little bit earlier, boot up early. And, you know, if our numbers are good, we'll go really go, um, go quite a bit earlier. And we did have a look in and see uh, there was a little bit of banter going in there, which was nice to see. So thanks to everyone who uh, yeah. got involved in that. <laughs> 
Uh, yeah, you, I literally cannot see anything on flight radar. Okay. Well, I can. There's one. There's one coming around the back at the moment. Okay. Two. Right, where was I up to? This is my this is my chance to catch up. Oh, it's just turned on. Oh no, though that was the one that's just landed. Oh. Yeah, there's an issue with flight radar. Right, go, have you got another app? Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll get on in a Jump second. On that, I'll please. just pray to God it's got dark mode because I seem to remember. Yeah, what... it's pretty dark as it is. That the other app, if I you've got the right. I can't app. remember what it, you're gonna have to remember what it's called, so I won't find it otherwise. Oh. I'm just looking at it. I'm just um, checking it's not our internet because... Uh, well, no, because I've got a perfectly working stream. I mean, all right, I'm in 144p, but it's still working fine. The other one I use... Flight is, away... No. No, it's not. It's... Sorry, I w- I'm going to go off the screen for a minute, so I'm not going to be focusing on this plane. I apologise. I just need to get the right app. Okay, yeah, she has got the same issue. Yeah, it's a flight radar issue. They do have issues with... I mean, if you think about what they're pushing out at times, it's crazy, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, so, exactly. Um, Good morning, Paul. Hope you're well. Happy Wednesday. Too, too many too. apps. Plane Finder. Thank you. I'll have a look in a second. Yeah, so guys, if you're looking for a, an, an alternative... It's always good to have an alternative. Um... I'm on Plane Finder, so... Uh... And uh, gives a bit, member for two months saying congrats on the 25k. Keep oh, thank you so brilliant much. brilliant work. Oh, thank you so much. Well, really do all appreciate down to you that. wonderful people. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. right, Holly, I'm so glad you're loving the stream this morning. And, uh, Samantha, good morning, saying uh, good morning, both of you. Thanks uh, for bringing fab footage to us. It's our pleasure. Um, the ability to find see the world got to be one of the best creations ever and don't uh, find newcastle to cos in three weeks with tui cool. well looking forward enjoy to that. that not jealous at all <laughs> i know we have something booked i just want i just want all uh, the holidays have, yeah we do i, was just like, I know no, no. i just want all i just want all the trips okay i'm greedy with uh it's with selfish trips. man what's all that about Yeah, Paul, I can't get flight radar either. Right, let me just grab pl- wherever plane finder is. Uh, well, it's going to be with P because I've got my apps in alphabetical order. I'm organised like that. There it is, plane finder. Oh, gosh. Uh, what's new? I don't care. Just show me the planes. Yeah. Oh, my. Okay. So, I can see the Gulf Air. Uh, that's some finals and just coming round the back we do have the Aer Lingus A330-300 coming in from JFK um, yeah have you got filters on on this? Um, I can't remember how to put filters on this cause I haven't... oh yeah there is a filters button whereabouts? Oh, I think you can only have it if you've got premium oh for god's sake this is why flight radar is good flight radar is the number one app I mean I know I you know I know well, that's it's their thing and it you know they know that flight radar thinks they have to offer something different don't they ah uh, yes put things behind a paywall that's what we all want oh god what a horrible horrible app no offence uh, flight finder well actually offence because it should be better Anyway, right, let me go back to the uh, the old chatteroo. Oh, there he is, Mr. Jet Set Extraordinaire himself, Living at Large. Mr. Living at Large, we have people talking about you already, innit? I know.
Good morning, Sarah. Hope you're well. Oops, not concentrating that. But we do have a BA shuttle pushing. I'm just keeping an eye out for that gulf there. It's just passing over Cheadle right now. Good morning, Diana. Good morning to everyone who's coming into the there chat. Yeah, so I'm just like, good morning, everybody. I don't know if uh, people noticed, but we the uh, the Tai A330 that we thought we were going to get on our stream, uh, the one that turned back as soon as it took off, um, a couple of days ago, actually came into Manchester yesterday. Um, well, did that look a state? Yeah, a bit worse for wear, though. It did, didn't I know it's been in storage for two years. But it it's like, like it do you remember that more. Thomas the Tank Engine episode where they lock him up in a... In a oh, no, it's not him, it was Henry, wasn't tunnel. it? And they lock him up in a tunnel. Yeah. Really dark episode. But And he comes out and he's all covered in like dirt and stuff because he's just been in a tunnel for like ages. That's like that. Yeah, it wasn't. He didn't look great. But, but if you sad, do... Someone Photoshop a sad face onto the tie plane. <laughs> If you do want to have a look here, there's some uh, great photos by um, Ender Burke and also uh, Airbus Red. Um, yes. Some cracking shots taken of that. Um, Good morning, Chris. I would recommend Harrison, but he hasn't bothered me posted one, even though he got shots of it. So I would just like, oops, mate. Sorry, Ox. Right. Um, I know, yeah. Do you know what? I know someone mentioned in the chat. Um, Sorry, there's the uh, um, Gulf Air's about to land. I saw it. Yeah, this one. And then, of course, you can make your point. sure about the stickers I won't lie I think I've made my point about those stickers in the past but um, that's good looking aircraft that go on Liz sorry uh, no so I mentioned the chat about radar box and I thought do you know what I'll, I'll, I'm going to download oh, yeah, they, they love good. sharing our stuff on yeah, Twitter yeah no, that's fair point so let's have a let's have a go um Well, I'll say a filter button, so that's always a good start, isn't it? I just want to search by an airport. Okay, let's forget that. My biggest thing is, can I put something... If I can put something in dark mode, I'm happy to go. That's the good thing about Plane Finder, it's dark mode, isn't it? Yeah, I just don't like... The interactivity with the app itself. Yeah, yeah no, I can see that as well. Uh, settings, oh my... This is like a, a, a live kind of review of like first time use of this. So this is fun. Um, first, first sort of minor niggle because uh, I'm a bit of a weird one like this. I don't like the font. I, I, I like a nice font. And oh, this, so I, I'm just telling you my oh, opinion. She's so annoying for that. I won't lie. I, I, I am a, I am a stickler for a good font. Oh, like, you've got to have the right like, font. Like, if you have the, honestly, it's such a you can no, put no, across no, a good no, or a no, bad no, thing no. with just the right Sorry, or wrong Liz, font. You're, you are a pain. You are a pain for it. Like we're doing emotes and like all the time she's like no 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 one no one. Yeah, I sound like a duck. Okay. Um, I won't lie, I'm not finding it. Right, here's a question for anyone: Can you get can you get this radar box in dark mode? So because if you can't, it's unusable for me for yeah. me. But do you know what? I'll give them feedback. I will go and give them feedback on that. If there, if there isn't a dark mode option. Anyway. I love certain things that you're at. The rest of it, I don't. Sorry? 
I like certain things on your app. However, rest of it, no. Well, it's just the thing. It's because of my eyes. I, no, I, no, no, need, no. I need dark mode. It's a... I think most people need dark mode. Well, exactly. Oh, hair lingus. I can't tell you what's coming in or out. You can if you use the other app. Just don't have filters. from JFK. Hmm. Oh, yes, we love a bit of that action, a little bit of flappage. Right, well, I don't think there's anything else coming in just yet. Anywho. Alright, apologies that I've just, like, neglected you all. Well, needs must. And, uh, oh, and I lost half my YouTube chat. Fantastic. I love YouTube for the consistency. Oh, God, honestly. Oh, hang on, I think I'm all right. Oh, I think it's because I was on uh, Top Chat, not Old Chat. Okay. Right. What have I missed? What have I missed, everybody? Oh, yeah, it's Matthew that mentioned uh, about using radar boxes. So, so uh, thank you, like I say. For, if anybody knows how to get it in dark mode, that's great. So, next couple of aircraft that are going to be uh, departing off runway 23 left here at Manchester are making the way over here now. We've got one EaseJet, which is that one there. And we also have the British Airways show that we were just on a moment before. Awesome. Good morning, Sue. Hope you're well. I've not seen a message from you, but I've seen the people saying hello. So, good morning, Kelly. Good morning. That might have been uh, a message that was that YouTube decided to chop off. <laughs> uh, I twelve. Good morning. Uh, Melbourne Aviation video is good morning to you. Hope you're well. Good job. Good to have you in the chat, mate. Saying. So, um, in uh, playing a spot in TV straight at Melbourne Airport in Australia. Proper um, Melbourne. Proper, yeah, real Melbourne. <laughs> but uh, I hope that's been amazing. Thanks, Riley. Hopefully, I'll have got to grips with uh, at least one radar app uh, before the Emirates gets there. But uh, thanks for the time bracket. Stuart, good morning. They probably, some of the long haul flights probably do just look tired as they land. They're like, oh, finally. It's been a long night. Well, you have a bit of a sleep now, can't you, once you get home? William, good morning. Morning, Vicky. Good morning, Carl. Uh, easy. 
Okay, 3.20 going to Amsterdam, so I'm like, don't know where any of the stuff is on that flight radar, please, I'm begging you, please start working. Can't cope. You just take a few hours to do anything, to be honest. Oh, dearing me. Um, Janet, thank you so much for the $25 super chat. And I so enjoy you two, uh, the awesome mods, and uh, the Think Plains family. Well, that's it. It's all part of the family, and you're a big part of it. So thank you, John, for your amazing support. Thank you so much. Really, really appreciate that. Oops, we're a little overexposed here. Think we might be. So we have this BA shuttle now departing back to Heathrow. It's going to be a bit of a turn and burn. Awesome. Uh, good morning, Stephen and James. Welcome. Morning, Andy. Oh, that's going back to Heathrow. I can tell you that one. Well done, Liz. <laughs> hey. Smashed it. I just feel like I've got like a smell of, like, forest. Like a can of air freshener. Yeah, but nicer. <laughs> so um, we have our first Jet 2 on the taxi on the way out now. Oh, Jojo, thanks. And uh, Money Bean say good morning. And, uh, yeah, thank you for letting us know that. Flight radar apparently are aware of the issue. I'm assuming they would be themselves. They're probably, they're probably scrambling like... They're just running around like headless chickens. Like, what have we done wrong? <laughs> What's gone wrong? What's happened? Go on in, Colin. Uh, Ashley, good morning. The thing I noticed with flight radar issues is if you have it, if they have an issue... It always lasts a few days, mm. so uh, just be prepared for that, people. You're not probably going to have uh, the connected. It'll come back intermittently. Good morning, Peter. I hope you're well. Um, but yeah, we might have a few days of issues with uh, flight radar. Oh, what is this heading for the train? Ready for the seven thirty-six? Choo choo. Oh, money being slow. Thank you so much. Gifting five memberships. Oh, thank you. Absolutely always, amazing. Man. Thank you. Uh, if you have just been gifted, please, if you are in the chat, please say thank you. And uh, Melbourne Aviation Videos with the two Australian dollars super chats saying uh, another, uh, sorry, nothing uh, plane spotting and watching a think planes. Oh, well, thank you, mate. Thank you so much. Really appreciate that. Liz has just put her uh, My hood, up. hood up. Apparently there's been some sort of significant power disruption in Sweden. Ah, OK, She's well, it's... It. Hopefully that won't be mean that it'll be too long before they get back up. Yeah. It's when they have server issues that yeah. they... Uh, the Morning, Al. Computers. <laughs> I don't know, St uh, Stephanie. Why did the plane sound uh, louder on my phone than uh, when I'm standing next to them at work? <laughs> it's just the magic of YouTube. Right, that jet two, if I can click on it, is going to Alicante. It's a 737. We're going to have a bit of a ketchup talk in a bit. Oh, ketchup. <laughs> Brace yourselves, everybody. Brace yourselves. We're talking mayonnaise. We're done salad cream. Today is the turn of ketchup. Uh, we're go I'm going to save you money. <laughs> I 
Yeah, we'll have this one go and then we'll, uh, we'll start that one up. Morning, Gillian. Hope you're well. Oh, we have some Carlos action right in front of us as well. Go, Stephen. Good morning. There's a two here. I didn't even see that coming across the runway. Oh, oh, oh. Hang on, we've got map options. Oh, there we go. Dark mode. Thank goodness for that. So, here we go, let's, let's start with the serious stuff. So, okay. I think with the cost of living crisis and everything, you know, everyone's noticed how much the price of ketchup has gone up in this country, and it's disgusting, and needs to be addressed. <laughs> it's like, it's the best part of five pounds for a big bottle now. I know, I know you can get them special offers, so don't get me wrong. You, if you love ketchup, I'm not just saying I love this ketchup. Well, I'm not as bad, I don't, look, we could start something in a minute about your mayonnaise last night, so I, I would zip it <laughs> over you. And, um... Yeah, I, I, I'm trying to, you know, save a bit, you know, if you, pennies here and there and everywhere. So, you know, I tried the Aldi one and, it, you know, it wasn't, it was nowhere near uh, Heinz ketchup, but it was decent and it was all right. However, we were doing a uh, sweet and sour um, chicken, uh, sweet and sour chicken, weren't we, yesterday? Yes. So, you know, we had to get some, so we had to get some new ketchup. And uh, so we went to Little and we got theirs. And I'm not going to lie, I think it's very hard to tell the difference between the two. Like... Rear, is the only la the only bit I could tell was the the end taste note of the little home brand. Well, you know their own brand one. Brilliant, and it cost literally nothing compared to the other one. I think it was like sixty nine p, wasn't it? Yeah, sixty nine p compared to like three three quid Take for the uh, a little. Every the, little helps. It's worth a try. Two quid, you could spend two quid on parking um, at the car park around there and come south side. There you go. There you go. Fun future spotting trips by having ketchup. <laughs> Sorry if this is outside the UK. <laughs> if you're outside the UK, it's probably going to mean absolutely nothing to you. But if you're in the UK, probably just saved you a couple of quid. There you go. What do you want? Can I have a coffee, please? Yeah. Um, That's once you've done the chat and everything. Well, it could be a minute. To be honest, I can do it. I'm just there. Uh... Well, there you go. Cheers. I probably can't open it anyway. Yeah, that's true. Uh, Dom, good morning, saying that got to my first job of the day to see I've been gifted a membership. Oh, Cheers. brilliant. Uh, Lee, good morning to you. Um, I'm in Dublin Airport. Where are you flying to? Oh, are you just geeking? No, I said waiting for a flight. Oh, okay, then. definitely then. <laughs> Oh, 
Nice. And uh, DRS37423. So, uh, me and the wife and kids are watching Wait for Two Flights of Paphos. Uh, watching, uh, sorry, waiting, uh, sorry. So, do you want to say that in English, please? <laughs> Uh, watching from Martin Park going on a holiday for their golden wedding anniversary oh sounds lovely amazing good well, morning Kevin before you watch that you can watch these two e-jets on the taxi out to this runway there we go Some uh, rustling going on behind us. Some rustling. Well, I think there's bird action. Oh, should right. Let's have a look at Carlos. There we have got a couple of Carlos's in, um, in the vicinity. Ah, oh, well, Matthew, you can ditch the scenes for his own brand now. See, I've sorted, mate. I've sorted. Little own brand. Well, obviously, little own brand. <laughs> Although, to be fair, they sell hands as well. Which they is, did, uh, right next to it, and I was just like, that is even worse. So make sure you pick up the right one because they look the same, obviously. Yeah. Got a little bit of Carlos in the uh, grass action there. Oh, we do have a two that's just touched down. I'm guessing this is position, in fact, because it's a 7 3. Would that be right? Oh, sorry. Um... There we go. Uh, yeah, Exeter. Yeah. Oh, dear me. Those curved split skimmer tarts. Okay, there's a Rainer from Cork on finals. Okay. We're concentrating departures for the next few minutes. That sounds like a good plan. We can all see them. Exactly. Don't need any apps for that. Yeah. It's helpful, isn't it? Oh, God. I, I'm all for, like, variation and choice, but... And I know it is because I'm, I'm so used to flight radar, but it just feels like it, there's a reason why it's the one everyone goes to. Like, yeah. it's easy to use. It's use like it, It's just simple. Everything's laid out well. Yeah. No, it, it looks is. good. And it can be individualised as well. Yes. Uh, Jonathan, I switched from Heinz uh, to M&S Ketchup a few weeks ago. Yeah. At that... one pound. It's great buy. I'm going to say... So I've I'm had seven. the M&S one. Okay. I, I, if you can, I would try this one out. I think it's better than that yeah. one. So I've had that one. But that is good. I won't lie. That is a good one. Uh, Paul, you need to go. You need to get some of this little stuff. Like honestly, it tastes the same. Um, the, the the end note is slightly different. But oh, like, this it, is Simon who's like I'm just there. Like it yeah, I, the same. I have a I won't have a decent palate, so it's like I don't think most people have probably notice it, but I did. But it's yeah, it's so small that you didn't tell the difference. I couldn't tell the difference. It tasted like Heinz ketchup to me. Um, but Paul, uh, do they still do Daddy's brown sauce? I thought they'd stop doing it. I just get hate I, see, oh, I think you can get it in like you know the cheaper shots like B&M's oh, right, okay. and Miracles so there is the um the EasyJet that used to uh, have the livery, uh, which was designed by the, uh, the staff, and um, the pilots really used to hate it. And I... yeah, they used to call it the uh, oh, I'm gonna say ugly ass. There we go, saying it. That's what the that's what the staff used to call it. Just saying, not what I called it. Uh, Larry, yeah, the egg, price of eggs is 
I don't think it's quite as bad here as it is in the States. I have seen the prices over there, but um, it's, it's still yeah, actually, gone up a lot. They have though, gone up they? a lot. Like you're talking easily a third over here. Yeah. I think I've seen the. Uh, they do the consumer up. price index over here, don't we? Yeah, so yeah. Um, you can get a rough idea, I reckon. But yeah, it's gone up a lot. Well, Rachel, hopefully now you know there's a, there are a few alternatives to flight radar, although. So Put it I, this way, I won't be backing any of them. Like, I they're have, great alternatives, but I'm not here. So I, I, have, yeah. I have a paid version uh, and a car... Um, what's it called? Because I use it for, like, looking at military aircraft. Yeah, I think that, that's my lucky thing. Was on about the... Uh, um, There's a couple, but uh, one that I use... There's a Ryanair about to land. Yeah, I use 360 radar. Ah, oh, right, okay. And it's, uh, it costs me £20 a, mo- uh, a year, I should say, not a month. <laughs> It'd be really expensive. But it's fantastic. I can see all the military movements and stuff like that. And when you were uh, in the lakes or um, at Macloop in Wales, it's fantastic to have. You see them going into the low flying everything. Serious? Who, what, where, when? So I'm on um, the uh, whichever one, not not radar box. The yeah, other yeah, one. Yeah. I'm trying to press dark mode. You've got to be a premium member for dark. Right, that's it. You're that gone. Is, I'm so, you that's are gone. Poor. Absolutely. Goodbye. That's poor. Right. You do with the disability act. Yeah. I mean, I know you've got like system settings, but still, that's not the point. Like that's uh. You know, but you're segregating you because of your yeah. I'm, coming, on it. She's I'm gonna... coming for you. Um, I can't remember what he calls. <laughs> Plane finder. Oh, I wonder what app Magic Mike uses. I don't know. Okay, anyway. So, next Ryanair's lined up. David wasn't okay sauce, wasn't that like a fruity one? Or is it that just brown sauce? Which one? Okay, so it's saying back in the day, brown sauce had to be okay sauce. We still get a transact. Uh, I just, it's not, it, I can't. It's in later. Sorry? It's in later. It's in later, there you go. I was going to say, it's just, uh... yeah, I kind of forget about it, won't I? Because it is later. But uh, yeah, we but you don't really end. notice it as much now because it's the A321. Yeah, I think that's what it is as well. When people used to have in the, uh, well, you know, back in the day, uh, the A310 and then, of course, uh, the A330 that we've had. Oh, Paul's saying that Tesco still sell Daddy's brand sauce. I oh, do. They might get some. Next oh, time. mate, wait a minute. Is he plugging his that company that you might work for? No. At the same time? <laughs> wait a minute. Don't be starting that, mate. No product placements. Morning, Paul. Only kidding. Um, 
But uh, no, as I say, in regards of just like just try it. Sixty nine p. You got nothing to lose by trying it, and I think it's I think it's pretty close. Good morning, Roy. I'm down in uh, Adelaide. It's great to have you in the chat, mate. It's uh, going on 4 p.m. local time there. Don't finish for the day and now uh, enjoying the plane. Sounds like a good day, that. Good day. Good way of getting through hump day. Yeah, how's this week been for everyone so yeah. far? We've, we've been all right, haven't we? Uh, Gillian said, just Google the best ketchup. Apparently, co op. Uh, the co-op's brand as the best for taste in the witch taste test. Yeah, I don't... I don't I, see, I, I don't like co-op. I don't like witch. Oh, okay. I was going to say I don't I, like... I think... I, I think... I, I, I was actually subscribed to him for a while and I was just like, no, I don't think so. Oh, that's what did it for you. Most people just look at which one and you're subscribed. Yeah. I remember they used to no, say... I tried it and I was just like... I, I, what, witch or ketchup? Witch. Oh, right. But, um... Yeah, I, I wasn't... I wasn't, I wasn't fell with some of their recommendations and stuff like that. I was just like, no, you're wrong. So I just went, no, I'm not paying for this anymore. I don't even know how that place exists anymore, to be honest. Um, so, Rachel, no, we're, we're good to spot here. Um, it's, uh, it's, well, it's National Trust land, what we're on here and stuff, so the, there's no issues at Manchester. I do know that, obviously, other airports... Um, you know, there can be new permission. It's always worth checking. Um, there's, there's spotting websites. Like, there's usually local groups on Facebook and stuff, like the local spotting groups. Yeah. Um, that will let you know if uh, you yeah, need to do it. I know in the States as well, I know, like, this obviously, you know, might not be applicable to everybody, but I, I do know in the States a lot of the time you might need some certain things for certain places. And Sorry, Les, we've got the first prop of the day. Cool. But, yeah, we're good at Manchester. I wasn't expecting doing that at 900 mil there. That wasn't great. <laughs> Morning, James. Yeah, <laughs> flight radar is down. There's, I've, I've had a whole rant <laughs> already about it. <laughs> All right, totally understand. It's. Uh, I think we've become ingrained to using it, haven't yeah. we? You know, it's. Morning, uh, Trevor. I, I, I dread to see what's in the Facebook groups at the moment. <laughs> flight radar's down. I can't cope. <laughs> it's just like, mm, just have to mate, for a few hours to be on. It's unfortunate, but that's life. And, uh, Trevor's saying, uh, watching your live stream on Symphony of the Seas cruise boat. Oh, wowzers. Uh, just docked at uh, Livorno, Italy. Wow. Sounds very nice. Get yourself a couple of cheap bottles of wine there. Oh, there we go. Enjoy the... Bo- oh, God. I, I feel sick just thinking about being on a boat, but um, I bet that's lovely. Yeah. I bet you're having a great time. I've never seen... I've never seen bad things about, like, cruises and stuff. Um... I just, I just, I just couldn't handle it. <laughs> I just feel like, why do I want to go on holiday to feel sick every day? It's not that for me. It's I, I, I like to. Well, I like to be able to do what I want when I want. But I'm... yeah, that, that's that's the problem with me. It's yeah, like, uh, I'm the same. But I can like if if you if you can buy into that, then it's going to be the best thing ever. Yeah. Because you're going to so many different places and stuff like that, and I know you got the travel in between, but it's a it's a nice way to do it. So I, I totally get it. It's just not for me. I was a beast. Apparently, uh, uh, airline videos had issues last night as well at the end of the strip. The, show, oh, the, strip, the stream, the, the show. Yeah, no, you had really. a few, few issues a few uh, well, a couple of months ago, didn't he? <laughs> he's, he's doing the stream and it was just like a fly radar's gone again. Mm. You just have to deal with it. It's life. You don't. Uh, oh, I have a little bit of a three thirtyness. We're probably you got to understand. We're probably going to be a bit late on some of these today. We will try and get everything as, as an arrival, but. Uh, with connectivity, it's not the exactly with, great. The, thing, the issue we've got with now with radar box, it's not as. A, and it's not as quick and it's not as uh, yeah, usable. It's not um, it. It's decent. The small ando. I like the fact that the airport at least is different colour. Then I can't see the planes on the. Thing. thing is, it might be as good. And it's like it's wrong for us to say. It's just that we're not ingrained to using it. And I think. Yeah. If you're not ingrained to using, you know, certain... This is what I always say to Liz about, you know, when when she has a go like certain patterns that I have with my Apple phone. 
And I say it works. Yeah, but the thing is, it works in my workflow. So if it's yeah. in there, then it's effortless for me to use. Yeah, so. what I'll say is, like, it, you have to really click on the right bit of the plane, otherwise it's okay. it doesn't, like, pick up that you're trying to see where that plane's going. Okay, I can get, um, understand that. Right, there is a... Hang on, I'm guessing it's a prop. I'll let you know when I can press it. There we go. Um, it's the air links that just landed before. No, 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 there's one coming from Aberdeen. Okay. It's a Logan Air. How far out? Uh, nearing, uh, hang on. Is that the right, yeah, near Cheadle? Near Cheadle, cool. We'll, uh, make our way down to the bottom of the runway then. Uh, nice to oh. see that air lingers. Oh, I've just got an ad. Oh, God bless her. Sorry, that's the, I, I, I'll be honest, I pay, I pay for, for flight radar, so I don't have advert. I don't have to do adverts when I'm trying to look at a plane. There we go, sorted that out. I still don't like the, uh, the, the font. I can't be the only one that is like a stickler for the, having the right font. Like, yeah, you are. I can't like any. I used to have a university lecture, right? And he was a really intelligent guy. And he used to do his PowerPoint presentations in Comic Sans. And I just like, have no respect for that at all. It's Comic Sans. Like, we're not 10. Grow Liz. up. Liz. Yes. It's for you to get your mind around, not the other way around. I'm going to start a petition to ban Comic Sans. I'm going to get a petition to ban you from the internet. I, I know which one I think will work out a lot easier. Anyway, feel free to use the uh, the run emoji. <laughs> Did that mark a good morning? Uh, awesome, James finds the Lisbon on Friday. Ooh, sounds good. And that Logan Air should be in sight any second now. Awesome. You can actually see it. You can hear it. There it is. Hey, both Simon and Kevin saying that crew, having it going on a cruise is wonderful. No, exactly. That's, this is the thing. is Everything's so subjective, isn't it? Yeah. You know, you oh, Kevin like, was a singer on a cruise ship. Wow. You know, you have so many people going, oh, this type of plane is great to fly, and then someone else says this this one. It, it, yeah. It's it's all about how you feel about it. It's not about... There's no definitive answer. Absolutely. Like I said, for me, it's just the seasickness. Morning, Jenny. Hope you're well. Absolutely. Awesome. Oh, some uh, double propage for us. There we go. A little bit earlier than normal. I know that we propage usually have one in about this time. Emojis. There we go. But, uh, two. It's a bit of a treat. Okay. Um, I think there's another plane on finals. Flying on behalf of Swiss, I think. No, flying oh. on behalf of Euro Wings. Euro Wings. Well, one in two guess, and I botched it up. It's a very strange little setup they've got going on there. Uh, there's also a another Logan Air from Inverness uh, on finals now. Well, the the Euro Wings one is, is unusual from the standpoint they're leasing out planes to other planes. I'm like, well, that's what I mean. Yeah, that one's that is an odd one. I won't lie. Oh, you want to get that nose gear down any second now? Uh, that's a that's a flare and a half. Oh, they were doing that floaty landing, weren't they? Because you could see it touch down as I actually, as it came over the crest of the hill. Floaty, floaty. Yeah, the floaty, floaty. Morning, Ben. Hope you're well. Is that Ben, Ben? Uh, no. Okay. It's uh, Ben Hartley, Ben. There you go. Great to have you in the chat, anyway. I thought you were someone else. <laughs> no, that was just what I said. But... Jonathan, good morning. Uh, Andrew, yeah, do you know a couple of people have mentioned that one? Is it a website? Is it an app? What's the deal here? Which one? The ADSB Exchange. Yeah, it is. It's a web based app, I think. It uh... used to be. I'm sure you have to pay for it. Well, that's a, well. I've got I've got an install there. Let's, okay. let's try this one. There right, we go. Honestly, live kind of testing out of uh, 
Tell me what uh, better back reviews, it's great, isn't it? Yeah. Let's have a little look see here, shall we? Right, yep. Okay, I like the planes are big. Oh, there's the Emirates. The only thing I need, though, is a different coloured map. Settings. Oh, look, another biz jet, is it? Oh, uh, no, it's the Logan Air. Oh, the Logan Air, the Embraer. OK. I thought today might be busy with uh, biz jets because it's the uh, Liverpool Arsenal game, isn't it? Yeah. Position or was it to knock or something? Wow, yeah, I don't think there's anyone on that. Uh, two seconds. Hang on, I need, I need to find, I need to find Anna. <laughs> Hang on, there you are. Hang on. Sort of like a shot. One moment, please. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Yeah, knock. Knock. I think. Oh. Is oh, that yeah. knock? Oh god, I don't even know. I don't know, it's going somewhere. <laughs> uh there's a British Airways about to come in. And Emirates is just about to turn on to finals. Well, I can hear some new. Yeah, BA Neo. Uh, there's an Aer Lingus coming in from... Sorry, I'm just not used to seeing where all the things are in a Snake 320 from, I'm going to guess, Dublin. The Emirates is behind that. Okay, cool. Um, right. Sorry, I was just trying to set up that, and I've just closed YouTube. Well done, me. That was clever, wasn't it? Yeah, sorry, I was just setting up that, that ADSB one. It's... It is, you can tell it's meant to be a web-based app. That is a lot more primitive. However, I can see the planes and I can make the map as dark as I want it. There you go. That's, that's review number three. <laughs> I think having now literally just tried all three of them, I think that one would be my alternative go-to. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's get this uh Erlingus. That's very true, Paul. How do you manage how do you manage back in the seventies? It's true. It's just like you have to get you'd have to you know, you know what time they were roughly due in at and it was just hitting hope, wasn't yeah. it?
<laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only one that Sarah's saying no. My daughter's doing a dissertation at the moment. Uh, love punctuation is a no-no in text, but her uni work um, it is used to perfection. Uh, but she feels the same about Comic Sans. Uh, well, hopefully she's uh, doing all right on that. I don't, um, I don't miss doing mine. I won't lie. I was in full panic. Need to finish my dissertation off my this time last year. Yeah, like she had, she had nothing done with a month to go. No, it was two weeks to go. Come on, give me some. Oh, I'm trying to be nice for it to you there. Uh, airliner camera, good morning. Oh, Suzanne, I bet you're probably already halfway to work, but uh, I hope you have a great day and uh, thank you for tuning in. All right. Emiratus. How close? Like, literally about to touch down. It's not. Well, well it's not because the car's, trust me, I can see it. Oh, right now. Okay, well, we're in the app. But I mean, the, the two is waiting for it, obviously, but it's... It'll be about to touch down any minute now. Bottom up. And here it comes into shot. The beast from the east. Still got a bit of speed on it, this Emirates. It needs to slow down quick. I was thinking that when it came in. Let's have a zoomy zoomy in on that wing. But it's managed to uh, slow down. Well, I just have so. to vacate right at the end. Oh, what is on the train? What is on the train update, people? <laughs> He's, ask, he's asking what he's missed. Uh, oh, yeah, Concord came in, mate. It was amazing. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, Stealth Bomber went out and right in front of us. I, the, I nailed the pan. <laughs> the pan was amazing. Morning, Stephen. Look at that epic wing, the A380. Hashtag Welsh wings. I see what you did there. Well... Oh. In fairness, yeah, I'm proud of that. So let's support our uh, British industry. Oh, thanks, Andrew. Uh, I did wonder what all the letters on the side were for. Now I know. Hopefully they can uh, plug the plug back in in Sweden soon. <laughs> Be handy, wouldn't it? Just a bit. OK, got a Ryanair now that's about to... Uh... Turn onto runway two three left. That's a turn and burn. Good 
Hello, morning, Richard. Apparently, we've got the better weather over in Teesside. But right. if you could share that, that would be nice. I well, wouldn't say no to that. You know, sharing is caring and all that. Exactly. That's a good idea, so let's just go like back to like old school plane spotting and like guess where the plane's going like. I'm gonna say that was a Ryanair, so that's gonna be going somewhere that's kinda nearest destination that you wanna go to, but you're gonna have to probably get like, a bus or a train. Okay, I think that's a shout. <laughs> Oh, we'll follow the uh, Emirates on to uh, Stan 12. I don't think there's anything else coming in, is there? Probably is. No. Um... Is that just flying over? Uh, e uh, no, nothing coming in right now. Okay. Some serious bird action going on behind us. <laughs> in the bushes. Which sounds really weird. <laughs> Someone's got the Night Rider ring trout. Epic. Morning, Darren. Hope you're well. Good to have you in the chat, mate. Why are you talking about Night Rider? Someone's got the ringtone on it on the phone over there. Nice bloke. Oh, right. Love that. That's going over there at a decent pace, to be honest. Oh, Jenny, five weeks will pass in no time and you'll be on that plane. Oh, be so good. Right, we're ready to go. What is that bird doing? I don't sound like a bird, that sounds like a... Squirrel or something. Yeah, maybe. Did it carry the squirrel? No. <laughs> I can do a few things that he can't travel there that quickly. All oh, right, okay. Awesome, Sean. I'll be on the uh, Singapore for 18 two weeks from uh, Heathrow to Singapore. Very nice. Everyone's going on the sort of dollar trip. Yeah, it's nice to Holly hear. Bobs. It? It's really nice to hear. And yes, I did just say Holly Bobs. I'm going, to try, I'm going to do an investigation on what that noise is now. One sec. Oh, here we go. Are we ready? Is that, yeah, the Airbus um, factory, I guess, uh, in Broughton does the uh, wings for Airbus. They like the hashtag Welsh wings. Do some David Attenborough commentary. It's the Robin. It's the robin. It's the robin. I can see it. He's been eating too much. He sounds well, really in fairness, loud. Yeah. In fairness, there's quite a few people who do feed him. So, yeah, it's, it's the robin. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so just behind the Emirates, we do have this uh, easy jet uh, that seems to be on its way out to us. Oh, have a good day at work, Sheila. It is hump day. Well, hopefully it's hump day for everybody. If you work at shift pattern, then maybe it's not, but... Or if in the United States, it's literally just turned over to hump day. Ah, oh, but if you're in, like, Australia and that, it's, like, close to the end of hump day. So you're practically at the weekend. We'll all get through it together. Exactly. Robin's a nightmare. Honestly, it's so loud. I just don't get how we've not heard him before do this. 
Well, I've heard stuff in them. Before. Not as loud as Not that. Not as loud as that, no. That's crazy. Just to say, uh, that's the uh, quiet area T3, the upstairs part. If you want to just go into T3 and just chill for a bit. We always do that, don't we? We do. Uh, the airport are actually advertised on Twitter, yes, sir, aren't yes. they? Yes. I was kind of... Uh kind of annoyed about that because i was like don't tell anybody <laughs> it was yeah. like well, every time i've mean, I been really early fights we've gone on but it was like usually i've been like maybe one or two other people up there i like it quiet <laughs> yeah i don't think he's gonna be quiet up there for much longer no i just hope it's observed you know what i mean yeah it just doesn't exactly. turn into like a free for all like a rave <laughs> yes well we'll see what it's like when we uh when we go out to fun shell soon yeah exactly Can't wait for that. Yeah, as I say, in a few weeks we will be going over to uh, Madeira, doing a few streams there for you. Should be uh, really good fun. Cannot wait. Yeah, hundred percent. Gonna leave the big coat at home. Oh, hey, your look. Oh, oh. Knowing your luck, it'll bring like loads of rain and everything. Probably. It's not the best registration for a plane, is it, TB? You just think of tuberculosis. Sorry, he's jet, but that's, that's, that's my take on that. <laughs> this is the tuberculosis plane. You say, you say tuber- I think of uh, just all the... I don't know. I lost count of how many assignments I did on uh, bovine TB. And actually, the last thing I ever did on it was a presentation on it, and I don't think... I was I was totally nearly done, and the... Uh, my uh, my lecture was a bit like, oh, is that kind of like, did, did you not find out about like this, that, and the other? And I was just like, no, no. <laughs> I just did panic. No, I just don't care anymore. I don't care. I think the uh, east, uh, sorry, the uh, Ryanair's going to come in front of it, and we do have a biz jet coming over here. Awesome. Right, what are you and where are you flying to? There's a virgin about to turn on to finals. Okay. <laughs> Say think. Um, yeah, there is, from uh, New York. Excellent. Well, the EasyJet is now turning on to the uh, Atif runway. Or TB, as I'm going to be calling it. <laughs> Let's call it Badger. <laughs> Good morning, Carl. We've got Ian. Good morning. Hope you're well. Hope you enjoy your brew.
Oh, Paul went up to the quiet bit the other day. Is it quiet? I said it was uh, nice to chill out. There you go. Is it still good then? Alright, Carl, yeah, we will do Dublin uh, stream at some point. Yeah, it's nice and cheap to get over there, so that's not going to be an issue. We'll, uh, we will be just uh, choosing the right time that works for us. We do have things in the pipeline, so uh, bear with us. Stay tuned. There will be more announcements in the uh, the next week. I'm probably going to yeah. go forward once we sort a couple of things out. Yeah, Diana, it's uh, it's a great airport. It's, uh, it's a really cool approach. And it's a very pretty location, I think, as well. Which one? Uh, from Charles. Yes, it's amazing. If you've got oh. any wind, it makes it a bit sporty. Yeah. Matt's off to Cyprus in a couple of weeks. Very nice. Um, said, but we really need to get on an autumn Madeira holiday uh, booked. All right, well, let's get this. They're expensive. We found them really cheap. keep up with that and that's because it was going so quick yeah wowzers that was up by where we are for a jet that size that's crazy uh virgin atlantic is at stockport excellent stay on this one for a little while wow that's crazy how high that is so, you know, you have reference points for planes going out. Yeah. That's at the 3,000 departure mark already because it's flat. Yeah, it's, uh, oh, wow. It's like it's uh, levelling out as we speak. Wowzers. Oh, no messing for them. Uh, so, Virgin's at Stockport, you say? I'll probably be slightly past now. Yeah, uh, well, I've got the thing down there because. Uh, heading towards nearly Cheadle ish. I'll keep it down there, I'm not going to bring it back. Morning, Carwin, hope you're well. Yep, great to have you in the chat, mate. That's a meal, good morning. Hope you are well also. And we have behind the Virgin, we have a Kayla Me Too. Oh. Very nice. Can't wait to get that on the way out. I can't even see that plane anymore. <laughs> that, that is bonkers. I know exactly where it should be, but no. It's what, sorry? I know exactly where it should be. Ah, right, okay, yeah. Uh, that's it. Well, Jenny, I would say, I think you should just stay and watch uh, this. Leave the haircuts, be fine. Oh my gosh. We'll, give, we'll write you a note. <laughs> oh my gosh, I've just like, I've got the yawns today. Oh dear. What's all that about? So yeah, our next plane should be here in the next uh, minute or so. Uh, BC, yeah, we did get your uh, super chat. I don't know if, yeah, like you say, maybe you missed it. But yeah, honestly, thank you so much. I just had to think about that then. But yes, no, I definitely did read that one out. Yeah, I think I can remember that one. Yeah, what that? yeah thank you. Amazing support, as always. Let's put another one in. I don't think so. I miss a lot of things, but I don't think I... I tend to spot them. I will be honest. And to be honest, I think the uh, the mods do tend to spot them if I've missed it. Oh, Matt, hopefully they'll come down. I, mean, I feel like every return flight I've seen to Funchal is like 40 quid. So uh, hopefully November comes down in price too. Yeah, it should be relatively cheap then. It's, it's expensive see... at the moment, apparently. 
Oh, no, you have to wait last minute. Yeah. yeah. You have to wait for a couple of months before. And that's when they put the reductions on it. But the, what they what the airlines always hope is that you book early. When If you book too early, you'll, they'll, they'll have yeah, the prices exactly. a lot more. So sometimes you just need to hold on. And I know that means sometimes accommodation isn't going to be what you hope, you know, because yeah. other people will be in there before you. But um, in regards of flights, you, you probably need to wait about two months before. And that's when they start yeah, reducing. They yeah, boost it around. I'll get some cake. After some day, we get some cake. I'm always, uh, I'm always up for cake. Morning vision thing. Good to have you in the chat, Paul. Also, what I should say is, if any of you are like, oh my goodness, where is, the, where is the mod father? He's, uh, he's got to go away, got to go travel for a meeting today for work. So we let, we let him off. We let him off. The day. We were like, no, oh, go on then. Go to a meeting. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, don't, don't be alarmed that he's not here. I know, uh, I know last time, um, uh, he wasn't in the chat. People were like, oh my God, where's he at? Uh, he's, a, he's a busy man, uh, but we're so lucky that he, uh, chooses to help us out. So, Absolutely. Uh, he has other commitments. Good morning, Carl. Hope you're well. Oh, KLM. Landed right on the crest of the bump there. Perfect. Sam, good morning. Richard, good morning. Oh, good idea, Mike. I said that's exactly my flight booking plan. Free hotel cancellations uh, so I can book that early without risk. You're on it. Exactly. Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm proud and Whitney lover. Uh, DJ pays a good morning. And Pete, a good morning to you over in Thailand. Oh, wherever you are in the world, it's great to have you with us today. Absolutely. Okay, let's see if there's any more planes. I've got a few coming out. That's always a good thing. Ryanair has just crossed the runway. Uh, we have a Jet 2 737 on the way out, and behind that we have an easy Jet A320, looks like. I can't tell from it. It's, it's a good distance away. <laughs> I'm just going to guess. A lot of probability an A320. No my luck, it'll be 19. Right, so there's a... Um, oh, that with the Dornier turning onto finals there. From Billund... It's on the screen. Oh, cities, sorry. This will be our next departure. It's Ryan Air Max. Where do you think it's going? Hang on, it is. just make it up I'm going to go to Copenhagen all the places in the world I'm just going to make it up um, probably totally wrong in fact I know I'm probably wrong hang on is that it there There's a Ryanair going to Parma, so yeah, I'm, that. I'm guessing it's oh, that two, one. There's two Ryanairs, actually. Oh, oh, hang on, sorry. I've got another... It's the one that's about to come onto this runway. Okay, hang on. I can't see the planes on the airfield on it, though. <laughs> that's the problem. You need to zoom in a bit more. No, it's the colour. And then I go into the other one, and, and nothing will click. Right. I think that server's dying. <laughs> okay. 
So, yes, I'm stuck with uh, some radar box now. And I can't see the planes on the airport. Just going to Parma. Okay, there we go. We'll, we'll get there, we'll muddle through. Uh, Mark, yeah, I've heard of that uh, Jack's Flight Club. I, I see a few things on um, oh, the, on uh, Facebook. Yeah, um, if you want another one with good deals, Holiday Pirates, uh, great, great app and website, I guess. But, um, I've I've got some cracking deals off there before. Uh, Holiday Pirates as well is in different countries. I know they're in different European countries, and I'm sure they're in the US as well. I could be wrong on that one. I think they are. Running jump. Oh, Beast of Sorrento sounds nice. You had me at red wine, to be honest. I won't lie. God, I love Italy for the wine and the tomatoes. <laughs> Not a problem, Martin. Thank you for tuning in today. Have a great day. So, this easy jet is off to Bilbao, and the Ryanair behind that is off to Dublin. I think the Dornier should be nearby as well. He hasn't had it. the Dornia over there? Probably is. Yeah, I think so. It looks like off. Yeah, it is. I think when we're on here we have to prioritise departures. I know I'm, I am so obsessive about the Dornia, but sometimes you just don't get it. We'll get it on its way out, though. Exactly. We have another Ryanair, and this one's going to Dublin. Might do a 900 millimetre pan on this one for for a laugh. See how bad the <laughs> pan is.
Do they like to have the two going out to Dublin at the, going out at the same time, don't they? They do. Because the one behind it's going to Cork. Oh, OK. I'll just get them all out in one go, why not? No messing. Sorry, I'm just looking at the um, like what we've got due in and stuff. Okay. Oh, is this. Uh... I know it's not, but it's something else. Oh, I think it is actually, what's that? Yeah, is this one of the. Uh... Yes, it is. It's one of the uh, retrofitted scimitars, uh, Rhino. 737 oh, okay. So as you can see, there's a little bit. The engines are smaller, aren't they? The APU's different, but the, uh, the scimitar's different. They're more curved, not straight lines like the uh, the ones on the Max. I like them. I, I, I prefer them. I, I think the curved scimitar look, look just a bit more elegant. In my yeah, opinion. I think they look really pretty. Go back to that later. <laughs> I think we'll jump on the skimmer on this. Look at that as it goes past. So I will read the super chat out after this departure. Uh, Matthew, thank you so much for the £15 super chat. Oh, wow, that's um, great, thank you. Saying, um, thank you for your stream getting me through a tough six weeks uh, with my father going missing and being found passed away. Uh, um, I saw that, I think you put something like that in the chat, didn't it? in the group. I'm not sure if I saw that, but honestly, I'm so sorry to hear that. Absolutely, mate. That must have been unbearably Heartbreaking. tough. Heartbreaking. Yeah. No, it must be. No, um... Yeah, I know my uncle had uh, Alzheimer's and he went missing for a short while and like, you know, we were looking that we found nothing. But as I say, it's a family like that must be uh, heartbreaking. So, you know, absolutely. Uh, Sending all love your way. Absolutely. Sending love to you and your family, mate. Um, also put at the end as well, get yourself some uh, nappies ready for the uh, 30 knot crosswind landing at Fun Charl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it'll be fun, that one. Hopefully we do go over there and it's a bit sporty. Uh, not too spot that they have to divert though, but just, just on that, you know, that threshold. <laughs> threshold. <laughs> a little threshold. So uh, yeah, thank you, mate. We do appreciate it. Okay, I'm gonna catch up with the chat. Gone quiet. <laughs> yeah. Well, it, it's nice to have this kind of little love for a minute. It gets people to get out time to get some toast. Get a coffee. Get a coffee. Get everything ready. Chill. Relax. It's all good. So, uh, we, we'll, uh, we'll have a look at the, uh, a couple of the uh, big heavies that we've got in this area of the airport. So we've got the Gulf Air, of course. They're doing quite a lot of work on that at the moment, trying to get turned around. Are they going to have a race between that and the Emirates? Probably. Good morning, France. Hope you're oh. well. Athletic. I was just about to look at my phone uh, on the uh, <laughs> on the app just to see uh, what was next in. 
Oh, it's one with the rubbish special livery that we got. A rubbish wow. special livery? Yeah, it's that E2 with the, uh, is it like the 1600 or 1500 like aircraft one? I can't remember. Uh, John, we will do some uh, evening stuff. We've just got to find the right time and day just to get the... Uh... We were, I won't lie, we were looking at last night. Yeah, uh, we just were. That we were just like, it's too close to the, the next yeah. day. I just thought, it's just a little bit too much. Just finding the busy period. But at least we know now, Tuesday evening, Yeah, might look good. So we will we will do it, especially as uh, the nights continue to get longer for another couple of months. and Or yeah. uh, well, the days get longer, not the nights. Yeah, I mean, we also do have other commitments, so it, it, it's just getting that nice kind of balance yes, into it. So absolutely. Uh, we will we will try and get some those, some of those dunks, there, especially when we're on uh, 05s. There's some uh, great action to be had here. Uh, Robert, no, not live tomorrow morning. Um, I will be sleeping and having a lion. Mr. Simon Lowe should be around. Yeah. Maybe even... And, uh, yeah, as Vision Thing just popped there as well. Yeah, lion can't wait to, like... Six o'clock, probably. <laughs> Not a problem, Paul. I'll take Mrs. Living at Large to work. <coughs> uh, Andrew, I'd had, uh, I think the RV, does the RVP open now? Is it at eight it opens? Should have a look. Yeah, just because say, uh, well, well, have a look. There's people on the mounds. <laughs> there are people on the mounds. Right, yeah. Um, yeah, go to the RVP. If you, it's only just a little bit further down um, while you're waiting for the pub to open. That would be my... Oh, come over here. I yeah. mean, either or. But if you're looking for someone with, like, facilities and stuff, then RVP. Yeah, and it's open. <laughs> exactly. As we've just worked out for you. Yeah. And if they want to take, <laughs> send us a cut of that money that they get from his <laughs> uh, entrance, uh, that's all good. I'm just going to pour myself some coffee. You would should. you like some, actually, while it's quiet? Uh, I'll let you go first, then I'll have a bit after, if that's okay. I think I need the coffee today. I haven't yawned oh. as much in ages. I haven't yawned, sorry. Yawned. I've yawned a lot this morning. <laughs> squeaky, squeaky. Oops. I'm off the, uh, <coughs> the pen and handle there. Not great. Oh, my washing machine saga continued yesterday, everyone. For all oh. you that are riveted by the washing machine saga. Uh, it's not really a saga, is I'd it? I'd love if someone from the place was uh, was, <laughs> was uh, watching this. Well, I didn't hear anything. I just got a thing from my last engine saying we've passed all your details on for someone to sort it. I'd assume they'd just get a new washing machine, but apparently not. I think I'm costing them too much at the moment. Um, yeah, because I've had some message about the electrics and the boiler again as well. So yeah. I think they hate me right now. Um... I literally like Hang on. We can multitask. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Uh, literally got back yesterday from nipping to the shop for a little card on the door and I was like, Well that's the washing machine people. Like I had a random missed call up a, a mobile number. No not a voice message left, not a text message sent, nothing. Didn't know they were meant to call. And I phone them up and they're just like, oh, yeah, I did try and come round. It's just like, like well, really bad. Why you tell bad. me? And she's like, oh, it wasn't your problem. Sorry about that, duck. I was like, I'm not a duck. What? <laughs> um, you are quackers, though. I know. But uh, well, I basically just gave them the product number. They were like, oh, well, I'll have to order the part and probably won't make it until next week. I was like, next week? See, this is the thing, right? If that was me now and with like my own home I'd just be like right buy right. a new washing machine next day deliver very happy days it's like 300 quid well parts exactly it, it, for, for that one it would just be quick it'd be quicker and more cost efficient for them to actually order. just do that exactly well we had the Air Baltic coming out already that was a quick turnaround is that the Eurowings one yep right okay <laughs> I'm trying to keep up with who's doing what now <laughs> You know what I've learned today is there's I always knew obviously you know flight radar and then you've got like the, I, I'd heard of the ADSB one and I've heard of obviously um plane finder. plane finder and radar box and now I've heard about three more others as well it's always good to have options isn't it options uh 
I feel like after today I could do an extensive review on them. I might do like a an hour long YouTube video on it because well, don't do that, please. <laughs> can't deal with the, uh, the grief. You know, like when you search on Google for something and like you just want like a really straight answer or like a list of things that you need to do or find or whatever, and it's like, here's a load of suggested YouTube videos, and it's someone going, hi everybody, welcome to my, my YouTube channel. I do uh, tutorials on, I don't know, cooking chips. I'm going to tell you all about the potatoes first and why I got into liking potatoes and making chips, and you're just like, can you just tell me what I need to do, please? Got a bit shit. We are going to be biz jet out today. Oh, um, wow. There are going to be a lot of these in for this... Oh, uh, uh, for the football. This football, yeah. Who's playing? Well, it's the title decider, isn't it? It's the uh, Man City Arsenal. Thank you. I was like, you said title decider then, like, as if I should know. <laughs> I should do it. It's your team. Yeah, whatever. Uh, morning, Taylor. We've got two of this pushback. Uh, Dreamliner. Okay. Let's see. Can I see anything on... It was on my uh, app, the app I'm using today <laughs> a minute ago. I just had a quick look, but uh, okay. it's definitely pushback to come this direction. Right, there is a... Hang on. Click. Click, click, click. There it is. Uh, there is a... I'm going to assume that's the Lufthansa. I don't. I can't find where the flight. Oh, there it says. It actually says Lufthansa. There. Okay. Uh, from Frankfurt and finals. Excellent. We'll muddle through. <laughs> that's good looking. A220. I think someone's just got pulled at the roundabout. It does sound like that, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? I was just thinking it's like, oops, someone was speeding. Oh, and we've had a bit of ATR Ridge coming out. ATR Ridge? Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> it's the brand Never. new term I just invented 42 seconds ago. Wow. This is how we roll in this channel. That's how you roll. Thanks. In life. <laughs> How very dare you, Elizabeth. <laughs> Record him. I'm guessing that's not a particularly busy flight today. But I'm going to say no. That was really early. Ah, and we have a 2737. And then behind that, as you can probably hear already, we have uh, the Aer Lingus ATR. I'd never have guessed. Shock. Horror. <laughs> And there's the lofty touching down. 
this uh, A321. after Fort Aventura. And just about get this ATR coming onto the runway get in the grill a bit get in the grill get in the grill why not eh Get them proper emojis going. So, uh, best time to use them. Right, well. A bit quiet here, but we do have a two Dreamliner now on the way out. Oh, there's all the prop emojis. No, I knew they wouldn't disappoint. No, they never do. So, this two e Dreamliner is off to Puerto Vallarta. Very nice. Thanks for the uh, aircraft movement updates, Carwin. Really appreciate them. <laughs> one in Hurdy. Just like, what, here comes the quiet ATR, said no one ever. <laughs> <laughs> Very true. Well, there's Rob with the uh, Helvetic info. To be fair, I've always just seen him as, like, Swiss, to be honest. Like, I know they're a subsidiary, but... You try to say Paul Man Swiss, which well, is no such thing. Well, I'm serious. This, well, I don't know. I, I don't know. I guess it reminds me a little bit of like, like Malta Air and right now or something. Oh, why don't you go? I'd go B A and B A C flyer. Oh yeah, that's a better one. Thanks, Liz. I forgot all about them. Let's get this two-week departure. I'm going to think about it first. <laughs> so I know. Well, we're prepared to be cleared straight away. Yeah. Morning, Alexandra. Seeing you in the chat as well. 
I know I've got a little bit behind and I've Uh, you guys are great at talking between yourselves, though. There's some constants. I've been, I've been there's some to... constants in life, Liz. Yeah. I know. Death, taxes, I've been and Liz to getting see behind what in the planes chat. are like going in and out, and I think like, I think the thing with you know getting behind the chat is the thing is with this channel we try to engage with all our view, viewers and oh absolutely I do my best and there's a lot so it. it pre- you know, it presents yeah, it has got, issues. I will say it has got a lot more difficult uh, compared to like our first ever stream. Exactly, but it's a nice problem to have. But you know, sometimes we're a little bit late on it. But, you know, we don't mean to do that. What um, I always say is, if I've missed something important, just put it in again. Put it in again. If it's something like you know, there's something coming in, and my mom, dad, grandpa, child, cousin friend whatever is on it uh, just get on the mods to message me Oh, thank you, uh, Daryl, there with the uh, flight radar update that they're, I'm assuming they've put on Twitter. I do know they were going to update that thread. Uh, apparently, the power supply uh, in Stockholm, the Stockholm region has been resolved, and we're working on bringing our services safely back online. Safely back online. Just turn on the on button. <laughs> Whack it with a, a hammer. Yeah, that's how you do it. Come on. It's got to be more than three switches. You wouldn't think so, would you? No, you wouldn't. What, you what I'm wondering is, why is he plugged in in Sweden? Exactly. Why don't you have a backup in, like, another country? Yeah. Far, far away from potential Swedish power supply issues. Why am I over there on 757 to the left of it? I was just like, going, mm, okay, that, that didn't make much sense. So we do have our first 757 departure. Very nice. Yeah, exactly. Love a bit of 757-ness. Thanks, Carwin. Apparently, we've got the Etihad pinging up. I'm pretty sure the Qatar will be pinging up yeah, any second now. Good morning, Cameron, saying uh, good morning, guys. Welcome to you at the pleasant surprise of a gifted membership. Hey. Uh, thanks very much for the gifted, uh, for the gifter, sorry. Uh, love the channel and your dedication uh, to the times and lengths and quality of. Uh, of content. Well, thank you so much. Oh, it's very nice of you to and, say. And uh, so. I'm glad you got yourself a little, little gift there, nice little surprise on a Wednesday morning. That's a good way to uh, get into hump day. <laughs> Heard you going, what time is your flight to Madeira today? This will be right out in two weeks. <laughs> nah, you say, look, I ah, showed you, didn't I? What time is our flight to Madeira? About 10.20. It's about 10.20, there we go. Not a crack of dawn job. No, it's one where we can actually get to the airport and... uh, Are we going to get the bus? We are getting the bus. We're getting the bus to the airport. Look at that, public transport. Unless it's absolutely chucking it down. Okay. (laughs) There's a caveat in there. (laughs) Fair enough, I'll take that. Right, from what I can tell, we don't have any more arrivals just yet. Okay. Oh, we do have a Ryanair going out, and we have the Logan Air Embraer behind that. Yeah, I think there's like a Ryanair, like, north of Manchester. I think that's about it at the moment. 
What are you? Are you coming here? No, you're not. Oh, yes, you are. There's um, a, what's it, a sass? A bit of sassage. Sass? So I did there. <laughs> I mean, it's not like sausage. It's not a silly sausage. I'm just like, now that I know that they've, like, I don't know, plugged everything back in in Sweden, I'm like... She's literally going to be on it every two seconds. Like, I'm a gold on? member. I want priority restart. Are, Are you back on yet? Are you back on? I feel like all the other apps must just have had like a surge of use. Like, Yeah, it's probably some of their servers aren't down, to be honest. I'd love it if my uh, if my freebie version got on before yours. I won't lie. Oh, I'd be fuming. I'd be tweeting them. You'd be tweeting, wouldn't you? And I'd be like going, yeah, whatever. What I will say is, obviously, Fire Radar does, like, go down from time to time. It would be good. You know, those other apps, they, they do need to kind of... Step it up for those Step time. it up for the times that you do have to use the others, and then it might shake, move people over. Absolutely. Because my experience this morning is I'm stuck with Flight Radar until there is a, a viable, comp, you know, competitor, maybe. Absolutely. Okay, who forgot to zoom out? Me. You forgot to zoom out. Uh, Gallo VDM. Uh, good morning. Saying uh, morning, folks. New to the channel. Uh, just into time to see my favourite aircraft, a uh, seven eight seven and an A two twenty. Excellent. Well, oh. great timing, mate. And welcome. Oh yeah, I forgot that last bit. <laughs> now, for considering you forgot to zoom out, that wasn't too bad. I know it was all right. Uh, it's what you call it. I just forgot to do it. <laughs> I don't worry. I won't forget to do it on this one. Because this will make me look silly if I don't. There we go. Thank you, Calvin. Uh, guitar pinging. We knew it was, it was a matter of time, wasn't it? Just a bit. But this one will have to wait in for a couple of minutes because it's a bit of a pocket rocket coming out of man. Um, There we go. Alright, zoom out. There we go. <laughs> that one helps. See some pencil emojis. Excellent. That's what we want to see. Uh, oh. Matt and I were, well, to be fair, who's saying where are we staying in... Um... Well, we're there. Yeah. Literally um... right next to the spot where we're going to be swimming yeah. from. It's like, it's probably about a 20 metre walk. Yeah, you said, or is it an every waking hour at the airport? So, I mean, kind of. <laughs> uh, no, I think we're going to look to do some, something else. I think we're going to hire the car uh, for a, at least a day and uh, go and have a I bit of fun. I explore. Yeah, I mean, Matt, I know you've, you've been there. If you've got any, you know, if there's any recommendations, feel free to send them over. Yeah, we saw that uh, when he'd been slow around there. Uh, I'm like, come on, come on, you can do it. <laughs> You've never spent, like, put so much positivity towards a nap in your life, have you? I will never take you for granted again, Flight Radar. Never. <laughs> the thing is, I've, had, I've known it to be down when I've been, like, at home and stuff. It's not an issue. But... You didn't stream. Oh, gosh. It's, no, I'm not. I'm not here for it. Oh, well, OK. Fair enough, Matt. So I do think we've had uh, it tough without that. Uh, Stockholm subway and traffic lights also lost power. Oh, must have had well, a, they I bet they've had a fun commute. Oh, Why are they whinging about? Come on. Sort yourselves out.
No, joking aside, it must be a nightmare, that. Yeah. Good morning, Steve. Um, we'll be here for a few hours yet, but um, unfortunately, I don't think we'll be here at two. No. Um, but I hope your friends have a fantastic flight. Where are you going to? Do we know? Uh, I, no. Okay. And the Etihad Triple Seven is now cross. Well, it's just crossed the runway. Good morning, you Ewan, up in Glasgow. Let's get in the grill. Claire, if it's you, give us a wave. Oh, there we go. Hi, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a, there'll be no one else here looking this weird at this time of day. <laughs> yeah, we're not, we're not hard to miss. <laughs> Jacket, big red beacon. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> So, I'll, I'll do this for what is once and once only. Oh, look at that gorgeous livery. Oh, my God, it's so gorgeous. Yeah. Uh, Funchal is uh, in Madeira, which is uh, just off Portugal somewhere. Somewhere. Portugal? Yeah, that way? Oh, it's an it's, it's, uh, it's island of Portugal, yeah, but it's, no, it's it nowhere is. near. <laughs> it, it's, it's quite a bit away. From oh, well, it's quite a bit away. All right, there's a, there's a bit more of a gap than I initially first thought. I think Canaries, <laughs> more than that. That is why we have Google Maps, and I uh, don't work for them. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's 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 just a bit off where the Canary Islands are, but um, it's it's an island on its own. Well, it's, it's got another island close to it, hasn't it? Uh, Porto Santo, hasn't it? So. Uh, yeah, it's the Madeira Islands they call them, but yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it, it's, it's it's definitely not off the coast of like uh, Portugal. It kind of is. I didn't specify how far away it was. Whoa, <laughs> I mean, that's a little bit loose on that interpretation there, Liz. <laughs> Morning, Mr. Bat. Oh, Andrew, it's funny you bring that uh, that little interview that um, Kevin and Rudy did with the uh, ATC over there uh, with that later tater. Later tater. That was uh, that was a great little interview. Uh, definitely go back and watch that if you haven't. Maybe this is going to come on now, but I think they're going to let the Jet Two go in front of it. I see. It's got good manners. I think they know that the. the oh, Magic uh, Mike's in the chat. Mike, you feel? Are you all right? Are you managing with that flight radar right now? We need a mic update, please. <laughs> if you're not coping, mate. Oh, God, I need to get to the bottom of the chat then, because then <laughs> all will be well. We're here for you, mate. Oh, uh, right, Matt, I am standing by for Madeira recommendations. I've been eight times and still find new things to see and do. Yeah. Well, I am here for the recommendations. I think they're doing a bit of astrophotography as well, aren't we? Yeah.
read Ingalls Joke out because it's on, it's on topic. Said, uh, I said to the baker, how come all of your cakes are 50p and then one's one pound? He said, well, that's Madeira cake. <laughs> Someone's buying a lip right there. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, okay, let's get off that because uh, the Etihad has turned on and behind that we do have a Logan Air. Very and... nice. Yes. It's getting busy. Let's get in their grill, though. And it's 600 miles from Portugal. I mean, yeah, it's, exactly. It's just, just off the coast. That's yeah, a two-minute walk, Liz. Two-minute walk for you. <laughs> Swim. Paddle. In your dreams. <laughs> Uh, this Logan Air is going to be going to Aberdeen. Well, they're going to have to wait a couple of minutes because the uh, mm -hmm. wait table is from that triple seven. Mike said, Doctor told me to try plane finder. <laughs> <laughs> Morning, hat up. Yeah, exactly, Matthew. I'm using the Ryanair measurement of how close things are. <laughs> oh, That's like the one, that one. Yeah. Well, I'm still on playing find up. So, uh, nothing else is working yet. Guitar uh, seven eight seven dash nine Dreamliner is now crossing runway one to come over it to is? us. Uh, we've just had an easy jet from Belfast land, but I didn't bother with that one. Thought you prefer some propage. And as I say, the slogan air is uh, off to somewhere because Aberdeen. Aberdeen. Mike's in the chat. I'm, I basically have flight radar back. Well, I'll tell, you how, <laughs> I'll tell you how bad Plane Finder is. It literally says that this is the Aberdeen to Manchester flight, not the other one. Well, there you go, Plane Finder. You are getting a one out of five from us. Wow, harsh. Harsh, that. Sorry. Yeah, no, I think I'll give, um, yeah, definitely. Not like it. Um, Harsh customer. Either radar way. box, I could maybe push to like a three. Um, it feels a bit easier to use, but I feel like it's a bit slow. Jump onto uh, Dream Miner. Uh, and then, well, I may as well complete the, uh, the uh, ADSB. You see, I feel like on desktop it's better. In terms of an app, though, it's also getting a three. She is harsh. There you go, that's the official uh, Liz Flight Radar app's ratings. What does flight radar get? Can't huh? give it a five. Can't give flight radar a five. It doesn't work. No. Um, I I have my nickels with it as well. I'd give it a four. Four. Okay. That's. I think that's a four. solid. Um, it's looking decent in that light. I mean, it's not the best light in the world, but it's decent.
Yeah, Mike. Uh, I, I would assume that's a safe assumption that it's returning to Aberdeen. Might be going completely somewhere different. You can check on flight plane finder where the destinations are going to, by the way. Well, no, that was the one that uh, was saying Aberdeen to Manchester still, no, wasn't I mean, it? you could just go and have a look at what's inbound and outbound and have a rough guess of what, what should be going That's far too much effort, and that is why plane finder only gets a one out of five. Oh. <laughs> I, won't lie, I won't listen to this for app recommendations. <laughs> I barely listen to for any recommendations, <laughs> never mind that recommendations. <laughs> Phil, this is about right. to go. Matt, I am screenshotting so that I can uh, peruse these things later. Hang on, did I get both messages in that one? No. Oh, I'm doing a zoomy zoomy because uh, I'll do a zoomy and a pan. Oh, I'm just in time for this uh, mutual dreamliner, right? With a 7 euros 87 super chat. So we're going with that one, and we're so thankful for that, so thanks a lot for that. <laughs> But, uh, uh, it's very beautiful. I prefer the old white one. Interesting. Yeah. I like these in a the good light. But, yeah, uh, in grey, the, 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 the grey just really ugh, just doesn't work, does it? But uh, yeah. I think in good light, these ones do work as well. Well, uh, Roy, thank you so much. Really appreciate that. We do. Thanks to your amazing support there. Mate. I'm glad I got it in before the guitar left as well. I see they're still waiting for, for, uh, for a while. Still for Logan to get out of the way. I think you should be well out of the way by now. Oh, not a problem, Money Beans. I have a good night's sleep. Yeah, take care. And, and uh, uh, we'll see you on the next one. Yeah, and thank you for your support. Absolutely. Here we go. Enjoy, everyone. Heading back after Doha. Where I believe it's pretty warm at the moment. I mean, it's not warm here. You try to say it's not warm here. <laughs> it's not 40 degrees, I know that. Yeah, you had a bit of a debate with uh, so. Yeah. Someone who's over there? I did. I've oh, got another Dreamliner that's pushed, uh, and that's Tiri. Ah, oh, not a problem, uh, Matthew. Have a lovely rest of your day. And thanks for stopping by. Yeah, we appreciate it. There you go. Uh, playing cast a good morning, saying what time to join. Well, when I'm about to get a brew. That was a great time. <laughs> right, thank you, Mike. We've got the Air France hop and the Finner in Breyers. We're about to turn on. Yep. Inbound in the next eight minutes. See, I was on that one. Look at that. Yeah, there's some ASMR for you. Can you just hold that for a sec? Yes, I can. Thank you. Oh, wow, well, Roy, thank you so much for the five gifted memberships. Oh. Oh, Roy, Thanks. that's too kind. Thank you so much, mate. We do appreciate it. Really? And, uh, great to have you with us today. Absolutely amazing. Uh, if you have uh, just been gifted a membership by the amazing Roy, do please say thank you if you're in the chat. Yeah. So, just to say, we, I think... Yes, we do. The Dawny is on the uh, taxi towards us. Fantastic. 
I think one thing I will say about Plane Finder is that they don't pick up the ground, uh, the, the planes that are pushed that quickly, mm. whereas uh, Flight Radar seems to be a little bit more on that. Yes. But um, we'll definitely take this Dornier going out. It'll look fantastic. Just waiting to cross. Is there a bridge jet or something on final? Oh, Mike, you've sold me at Drive to the Top of a Mountain. Because, yeah, we don't, we're not there for ages, you know, we've got to fit streaming in. I'm here for driving. <laughs> we were literally talking yesterday about like how, like in the states, where um, there's a lot of places that are, like really like big tourist things, and mm. there is a road right to them, a car park, maybe even a gift shop, toilets maybe. Um, and the most you'll ever have to walk is like three minutes, yeah. so like the perfect lookout point. And I'm here for that. Morning, Gareth. Hope you're well. I think this uh, Donny is out to make me look silly today with my panning. Yeah. What are you thinking, Liz? I think you can. I think you can handle it. I think I can handle the Donny. Um, yeah, Alex. That's the. Uh, that was the impression I got from um, that ADSB. That I think on a, on a computer it'd be great. Yeah. Sadly, uh, you know, when you're sat out in the middle of nowhere, essentially, there's no computer. There is. Well, there is, but I'm not wasting the battery just for that. Yes. I still won't be able to see it anyway. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah, same with my 360 radar, to be honest. I think um, that works better as a uh, web based app on a computer. Yes. Oh, I'll tell you what, this Donny is getting down here double quick. <laughs> Like going, oh, I can hear you can zoom to 900 mil now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to make you look silly, Si. And I'm just going, yeah, I know you are. Uh, don't worry, I'm not, I'm not zooming in it for uh, that. See you later, Samil. Thank you for joining today. Yeah, thank you as always, mate. Here we go. Yeah, France just touched down behind it. But we're staying on this door here. Rocket rocket. What what millimetre was that then? Oh lie, I was like I was going anywhere near uh, six hundred uh, six hundred on that, never never mind nine hundred. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no that's uh yeah that's not one when you go uh, that close to it. Then my allergies are kicking off a little bit today. Really? Yeah, oh. I've uh, had a little bit of a wee runny nose. Oh Krishad, good morning. Let me know if you need a tissue. I've, I've got, some. I've got one. Oh, you've got one. Yeah, I'm good. I'm, oh, I'm, uh, I'm sussed. I've been there. Uh, the old cleaner Rui. Cleaner Rui. Yeah, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> this is what happens when there's like no planes departing. <laughs> this is Tui coming over here now. Yeah, but he's taxiing. It's not departing. The door you just took. Uh, just took. I know, but it's in. It's a law between. <laughs> we need it. We need it quicker. <laughs> wow, is this? Liz has the attention span of uh, a goldfish. Less than that, I think. I blame TikTok. Blame the mighty talk. Oh, and uh, Finna. See, there, there are planes. You just didn't see them on fire radar. They didn't tell me about them. To be fair, I did, I did kind of tell you about that one. You didn't tell me that it was that heel green, which is our reference point. In fairness. I didn't, no. You're right. Okay, well, there's... Um, Cheers, Matt. I've just got that message. I've got... There's an Erlingus ATR from Dublin. That is at Cheadle. 
excellent see that 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 i can work with i know roughly how long and looks like we do have some business digital action coming our way and what are you are you coming this way no you're not i think i will go down to the bottom of the runway to the bottom of the runway well if there's an arrival yeah oh right yeah yeah okay Yep, it's definitely, if you have any allergies, I would definitely say start taking uh, antihistamines. I've lost mine. Well, I'll have to get you some, but... Uh, it's... <coughs> say that I start coughing. Yeah. I am feeling the pollen today. I think I've just mind, messed with yeah, your you mind have. and now you're thinking, oh, there's pollen, I've got a cough. Oh, well. It's a bit brighter than I thought it would be today. Yeah, do you know what? That's a very good point because I'm going to up my shot speed a bit because I agree with you. That's a good idea. I'll be hitting the... And here's the ATR. A bit of focus on there. Happy days. <laughs> just, Mikey Boris, clean and ready. <laughs> yeah, Mike, just for you, mate. <laughs> That's what we do in this channel. We just stick Rooney or. We just put two words together with we a just, Y on the end. Yeah. We're, we're out to destroy the English language, basically. <laughs> Stay on the two as he goes crosses. <coughs> so where's this two going to, Les? I'll try and find out. You've really like. <coughs> oh, stand up then, please, for a minute. <coughs> it's not going to help. It does. Um, right. Where is this? Is that it? It'd be the big plane crossing the runway. Gosh. It's uh, yeah, it's going to. Nope, that's a different one. What? Oh, like I, I think the way it is at the moment, I could actually fly there and back. And <laughs> I think I'm just going to. Uh... Oh, where that? What? I'm going to knock another point off. But I think I'm, I am on radar box here. It's going to. Luton to Malaga, apparently, and it's Thompson. Excellent. Apparently, we've, like, regressed back about 15 years. I've got it down to somewhere else. <laughs> it's <the look>. No. <laughs> no. This one's going to Amilcar Car Cabral. <laughs> Mike, where's it going? <laughs> Help us. <laughs> it's going somewhere. It's going to fly in the sky. <laughs> no, so, he's so got high. the same. Oh, you're using plane finder as well, aren't you? Oh no! We're all coming up with really dodgy. Oh, we've got the... oh, oh, oh! Hang on. It's going to Aspargos. We are flight radar twenty four back, everybody. Oh, it's you. back. Yeah, you obviously call it something else, doesn't it? That's Aspargos. Phew. Oh, normal service can resume. And the second Dornier is coming out as well. Fantastic. Wasn't quite double Dornier, but you know, it was even far off. Uh, I mean, yeah, we are working. Oh. Relief. Yeah, after that little last hiccup, uh, the radar box just got knocked down to two and a half out of five. Oh, wow. I'm sorry. Oh, here it's we go. It's not been Thompson Airways for a very, very long time. And to have it down as going from Luton to Malaga, I mean, your server's got overloaded. You can you can all breathe a sigh of relief now. So all, all those other apps can just go, oh, 
we're all we're all like second choice again. <laughs> right, I can tell you everything that's going on now. Well, I don't know where this little thing's going to because it, it's not got a destination in it. But That'd be King anything Ridge, else. It? The other one went to Billund. Oh no, I'm looking at the Embraer Fenham. Oh, okay. I'm Sorry, on. that's what I meant. And uh, EasyJet is going to Nice. Well, you know, you're having a go at what do you call it? It's not on flight radar, this. No, that's true, but that's that's the transfer. So you got to knock it down to 3.5 now, don't you? Because you've already had it down as a 4. It's just... Uh... Yeah, but it's... Usa- Ooh, the, usa- we... the usability of the air. It is. It's, 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 yeah, no, but the, if the planes are on it, you can't surely give it the No, that's number. true, but most of, at least the ones that are are going to the right destinations <laughs> for a start. My niggles with this app are... Um, I want the planes to change size as I zoom in and out. Um, I'm trying to think what else. I don't know. I'd have to think about it critically. Okay, I'll let you do that. See how you get on. There we go. Well, I defeated the uh, Dornius today. Sorry, I made you look silly. <laughs> Morning, Rebecca. There we go. We're going straight away. This is a good turn and burn. And that's going quite a distance because oh, like they I... usually get up quite early. Oh, I feel like I heard the hamster start running on the wheels to get going there. Uh, yeah, it doesn't have a uh, well, it, flight radar. It doesn't have a destination. It might in one of the others, but I don't care. <laughs> oh, I can look on my thing if I want to find out what it. And uh, Mark, good morning. Saying great to see that three thirty in yesterday. Uh, do you know why uh, it was? in as it was in storage but it's going to STS yeah. so whatever they finish with it I'm guessing I, I don't really know what, what do STS do because I feel like at the moment they just get planes in and just service park them. them up for the service and well, no, the park thing them is, up I'm for not, a little bit I'm not sure exactly, exactly sure what's going to happen with that so that that's the issue I mean uh, are they bringing it back into service though for it because it's been at two years out of service it needs quite well, quite a bit of work wasn't it um, well yeah definitely I don't know is it being converted? I don't know. Who knows? I don't, I don't know what the plans are for that plane, so... <laughs> right, that's enough stress for today for me. <laughs> I'm with you on that. But yeah, that little uh, Dornier was off to Cambridge. Excellent. Right, everyone, fingers crossed for Paula's car that's just been picked up to go for a service and MOT. Oh. I like it's been picked up, though, so you don't have to leave the stream. Like, it's just like, yep, you take the car. I know, but it's like the worst feeling ever. Like I know. I always feel that, you know, the times that I, I always think I'm going to pass, I always fail. Yeah, I know. I think there was a, was it not, well, there was recommendations, at least on mine last year, I don't know. Oh, they were nothing, though. That no, was, I know, but I'm just thinking, thing. is it by this year, is it going to be a, a thing? No. Okay. All right, see, so he's just building up.
got Ryanair about to touch down from fake Brussels. Uh, well, making do one. <laughs> Our next one, Rebecca booked flights at LAX uh, on a Friday to see friends I haven't seen since 2021. There. Oh, that would be awesome. That would be really good. Enjoy that. Oh, the light's just gone up about two, about a stop and a half here. Yeah. Um, yeah, I need to get my uh, camera sus for that. Otherwise, you'll uh, start seeing a load of blown highlights. Oh, we don't want that. There we go. So, it's, oh, the light looks like we're going to... Well, I, getting a, I don't know if it just uh, double-checked the thing. I'll just get a couple of spinny circles. I think it might just be me, but Thank it's you. probably worth a check, you know. You shoot. It's me. That's fine. That's all we need to know. Oh, thanks, Matthew. I don't really fancy buying uh, a suitcase off a voucher, though. I feel like it's one of those. I feel like I need to go and see it in person. Yeah, you know we, what I'm getting. we've got specific needs about sticking well, what we need to put in it, don't we? Yeah, exactly. So, uh, yeah, I think it's one that we need to get put our eyes on and uh, give it a Have good a old kick in. Before, yeah, exactly. We... I mean, literally, whatever we buy is going to last about three flights, probably, anyway. I mean, my one that we've used probably did about four trips in total using that case oh it's ridiculous oh great no I, I'm not I can't I'm not it wouldn't it wouldn't be right if I sat here just pressing a button going this is the something something flight to so and so and it's uh, this plane and I need to automate it It would have to make a big whale mating noise, wouldn't it? When I'm uh, yeah, if we've got a charger yeah, at some point, that'll be cool. Yeah, that's cool. Right, let me get that charger for you. Thank you. I'm hoping this uh, BA is not going to go straight away. What is this back in the chat? No. Thank you.
Right, so that Helvetic was on the way back to Zurich. And... I, I don't know where that thing's going. Actually, is it British Airways? Yeah, of course, yeah. I don't know. I, I wanted to be able to see it on there. Right, where's, okay. it, where's it going to? Where's... Heathrow. I didn't know it was British Airways. Oh, you mean flight radar's still not working? It's working more than it was. That's all that matters. And we had the Jet 2A321 that's going to come right in front of us. That should be decent. As long as this British Airways shifts. Get this babe coming on. So, morning, Andy. Hope you're well. After Paphos, What is you've ruined your breakfast by putting mushrooms on it? Bacon, sausage and mushroom balm with brown sauce. Wow. No. <clears throat> wow. Put an egg on it instead. Be normal. <laughs> there must be a plane landing because that E2 doesn't look like it's going anywhere. Uh, there is in a moment, yep. So, sass. A320 Neo from Copenhagen. Well, we'll focus on this too, eh? And as you can tell, it's one with the uh, Curse Scimitar, so it's, uh, it's an 800, 737 800. Well, thanks, Rebecca, that's awesome. Well, let's get the SAS. Well, it looks like new livery, doesn't it? Yeah, oh no, it's old livery, ugh, I wish it didn't bother now. <laughs> Oh, I feel like I've been robbed. You have. You have. Well, especially after all the the uh, the chaos in uh, Scandinavia today. Well, I, I mean, I it's a different country, but <laughs> what country was it in? The issue? Sweden. Oh, sorry. <laughs> or is this like me saying that uh, Madeira is just off uh, just off the coast of Portugal? <laughs>
don't know how that's going because it's not changed its destination yet. <laughs> uh, next in is a Jet 2 that's coming up from Birmingham. Or has come up from Birmingham, should I say. Good morning, Ian. Uh, morning, Mr. Pingu. Hope you're well. I mean, going back to your, your SAS point, it is like the flag carry of, like, Yeah, Yeah, no, I know, that's true, that's true. You know, it's, just a, it's just a conglomerate of play, uh, Oh, places. I know, it's just that one came from Copenhagen. What's all these people like in mushrooms? Next, another one. I think nearly, nearly took, was halfway down the runway before I got permission to take <laughs> off. Uh, well, I'm a good Morgan. Speaking of good Morgan, La Santa. Oh, look at that timing. That was like as smooth as porridge. Oh, wait a minute, that's not smooth, is it? Maybe if you have like ready break. Yeah, that's, true. that's not proper porridge, though, is it? I don't know, I don't like... I don't think I've ever tried ready breaks, to be fair, but... It's like wallpaper paste, that. I prefer something with a bit of... So is... That's what porridge is. I know, it's like... No, no, proper... It should be like... With pro, if you get some good quality oats in there, no, you're wrong. All so. oh, right. I've never really uh, experimented that much with porridge, because I don't think there's any way to make it nice. Maybe just stick a load of, like, chocolate sauce in it, which surely defeats the object of eating porridge. Uh, travel awesome together. Good morning. Saying hello from the Maldives. Oh. oh just sipping a cocktail on the beach. It's all right for some, isn't it? Liz is like pretending to be nice here. She's on the inside. She's like going, I hate you. <laughs> In a jokey way. <laughs> well, I hope you're having a great time over there. Sounds like it. Yeah, it does. I mean, as Wednesdays go, being sat on the beach is, it's up there with the best of them. That's all right, Chris. Like, I was already on it. Like, the second flight radar started working, I declared it to the world. Uh, there's a Ryanair. Um, About to land. Yeah, from Malta. I think we'll just concentrate on this A321. on his way back to I think it was Frankfurt I think I think it would and, be it was um, one. yep and as Mike said we've got our two Singapore Airlines due soon excellent can't wait for the A350 to uh, 
make an entrance? Let's just check up. In fact, one of them is on finals now and is approaching Stockport. Excellent. That's the one from Singapore. Well, just looking over now at the heavies that we uh, had a bit earlier, the Gulf Air looks like it's uh, pretty much ready to go. I'm just guessing they're sorting out boarding. And the Emirates, I still think they're doing uh, some loading at the rear there. Yep, you can see that. It's not due out for another, like, 20 minutes like that, though, is it? No. So, that's all good. Oh, yeah, I can see the uh, Singapore <laughs> just going over stop pot. There's a bread debate going on in the chat. What? <laughs> Please, please let me know what's happening there. Well, it's just, is it a bap? Is it a bomb? Is it a, oh, a roll? Is it a... I'm sure we've had this one quite a few oh, times. I think we have. I said some... but didn't you get it sorted out the first time, people? It's a, it's a tough point. It's a tough cookie to crack. Well, it's not a cookie. It's, it's bread. It's either a bomb or a bap. Well, I'm getting all them through now. Well, why things aren't happening, I'm going to start charging up on my stuff. That sounds like a good idea. Chip bomb with HP sauce? Oh, no. Liz has judged you. I hope you I know that. Brown sauce with chips? Actually, well, you can. You why can. not? Well, you can. I just... Not, no, I just... No, it don't work for me, that. I, so honestly, her, her double standards are just <laughs> hilarious, trust me. I, there's times that I'm just having a conversation with her, and I just go, are, are you actually for real? <laughs> oh, I like it with this, but then when you hope it is... Mm. And then she just goes and then plunks. Right, so we had, like, sweet and sour chicken last night, right? <laughs> with, um, we did some... Um, salt and pepper chips. Salt and pepper chips. And, you know, a bit of, a bit of rice. And... Liz then brings in the mayonnaise. <laughs> I'm having chips. I'm having mayonnaise. And you know, we, the thing is, you didn't splodge it on the chips. You actually put it on the uh, sweet and sour chicken, which I, I won't <laughs> it's, lie. It's fine. I won't. No, it's not fine. You can say it's fine. It all goes down the same way. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry it was disgusting. You need to, <laughs> you need to sort out your issues, girl. That is... Uh, that so is really nice, though, considering, like... Like, I felt as satisfied eating it as well. Like, I've had worse um, from, like, an actual Chinese takeaway before, so... Well, it, there were a couple of issues where we, we didn't oh, leave yeah, ourselves well... enough time to prep, every, prep everything. I think that was the biggest issue. It was. But here's Singapore, anyway, so let's get this down and we can have a... You can see how bad the heat haze is now and it's not even that warm. No, it's not. Uh, next on finals, we've got Ryanair from Barcelona. It's a bit of an anticlimax after they get the Singapore A350. I know, I know. Well, it won't be long until we get another Singapore A350. It, it is just 12 minutes away. Oh, that's not bad. So, they seem to sync these really well at the moment, don't they? They do, yeah. Uh, that one's coming in from Houston. And what's that behind it? Oh, it's a Ryanair. <laughs> Again. Again. The anticlimax after the Sig 4A350. So many Ryanairs. Oh, they do a great job for Manchester, don't they? I'm not going to lie about that. Might not be everyone's cup of tea. But uh, they do a great job. Right, let's see how many people are out on the mound over on the other side. That quarter of a lot of flights, like... I... How long ago did they... Well, I can see how long ago it took off. I just feel like it's gone like really far and which is actually probably a very normal space of time but well you know like I said the Gulf Air looked ready to go yeah it's pushing look at that then oh well you can uh, 
I'll pretend I know what I'm on about now. I'm just like really ham it up. I'm going, oh, I know what I'm Don't forget about. the Ryanair that's on finals. I have, I have, I have forgot about it, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> oh, oh, the, right, the moderator is speaking. <laughs> Stand back, so, everyone. Here are the facts it's a bomb, brown sauce on chips, ketchup is for girls and children only, and eggs belong in the bin. This is the way. Yeah. No. What what rate is if you knew how you sh- uh, to tie your shoelaces, you'd be lethal, lad. That's all I'm going to say <laughs> to you. Oh, and I've just seen Jim's in the chat as well. Oh, Mr. Bing, Mr. Bong Bing himself. Yeah, he's in for a flying visit. Just coming in and going to tell everyone to hit the like button and then off he just goes let, again. Just listen to Jim, people. Yeah, he's not messing around. Be more like Jim. Yeah. Well, actually, do, do less work. In a world of wadders, be more like Jim. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Sorted that one out, didn't we? Lindsay's saying in Leicester it's a cob. Right, yeah, cob, it is. Cob's a weird one. Well, I remember like a firmer bread roll used to be called a cob, but up north right. back in the day, but uh, I'm not sure. Yeah, to be fair, I do see like a... Like a dinner cob, I remember. Yeah, I, well, I see like a bomb as like a soft yeah. thing. Whereas, to be fair, I'd say like a bread roll for like the harder ones. Oh. I bet people in, like, the States and stuff are just like, don't you all live, like, within a few hours of each other? Like, how can the language change this much? Because we're all weirdos over here, that's why. Yeah, because the thing is, you go through, like, different... Like, I, I've gone from, like, New York down to Florida, right? And I'll be honest, apart from, like, the accents, I feel like... Well, but I know stuff probably did change, well, but, like, probably not as much as the bread changing. <laughs> yes, I know, but there's, there's an interesting thing with, like, New York and... Um, Florida in that a lot of the affluent people um, who in America do move between those two areas so they have the winters in um, Florida Mm -hmm. and they um, then spend the summers in New York so you do actually kind of get that cross population in regards of dialectology and syntax as well so uh, there you go there you go facts for you I don't want to say it's pure facts but it's uh, there have been a few things I thought people would I suppose a lot of people like don't like don't stay in the city though in the summer do they? Cause it gets really hot there. I've heard. <laughs> I've not been in New York in the summer. Then don't they go up? Florida's hot. Yeah, but you said Florida for the winter though. Yeah, but Florida's warmer in the winter. Yeah, yeah, for the winter that's fine. But you said New York for the summer, but yes. then it's too hot. In, it's too hot in New York. Yeah, but it's hotter in it's hotter in Florida. Oh yeah, no, it's hotter in Florida. Well, I'm, well, I'm saying you... if, if you're going to live in the United States, you're going to probably want to go north, aren't you? Oh yeah, you are. But don't they go to like? like the Hamptons sorry I've watched too much Real Housewives <laughs> they're, they're, they're in that area yeah I know they are but it's a bit uh, cooler listen, there you, you're, not, you, you, you're really off on this argument I would stop I'm not arguing I'm just like I'm just, I'm just trying to learn more I am trying to learn oh no you've had a nightmare girl sorry. you know what just drop me off at Disney I'll be happy oh, I'll tell you what I'll throw you out 35,000 feet without a parachute if you want oh wow to be honest, don't throw me out of 30,000, 5,000 feet with a parachute, to be fair. No, that's fair to use as well, to be honest. Yes, yeah, so the main, ha- main cargo hatch has been closed now. They've just got the ladders at the back. Awesome. And the A380. And the single Porsche should be here any time soon. Would I be right in that? The what, sorry? The Singapore A350. Oh, the next one coming in. Yeah. Let's have a look at two Ryanair tails. <laughs> okay, didn't think you were going to get that on the stream today. It's about to pass over Bolton. Okay, it's still quite a distance away. I want to see if I can see it then. It's so hazy, I'm probably going to say no, but... I will play in Castro. I'm glad the meeting is done and you can watch some planes again. That's what it's all about. Do the meetings, watch some planes, type up a report, watching planes. <laughs> That's the kind of stuff that uh, I've done this channel. Uh, we have that Ryanair now. Uh, going over to T3. I'm guessing some passengers will be playing a game of boarding, not boarding right now. Gotta love a bit of boarding, not boarding. You do, don't you? 
always makes me chuckle when um, the YouTube brigade, you know, the uh, the travel people, you know, who do travel blogs are always complaining about bored, not bored. And it was like, going, guys, and it is, you know, it's, there are there are a couple in particular, and it's just like, guys, you know why they're doing it. Chill, will you? You might not like it, but I'd, I'd hope. <laughs> Doing as many of these blogs as you do, you'd know the reason for it. But, um, exactly. They want uh, they want to turn around in twenty five minutes. If you want, if you want twenty pound fares, that's what you get. The thing is, I I kind of understand as well. I can understand having boarded flights, and you do it the traditional way. You guarantee there's always usually the odd straggler. It's always a couple. Yeah, remember, so- back in the day, I always just remember like in the terminals, you'd have people being um, on the you know the PA system being yep. called to the gate last minute. And oh, I, I don't. God, yeah. th- I don't think it's as noticeable as it used to be. No, it definitely used to be not. really bad. Yeah, hundred uh, percent. Uh, but I don't think it's as bad now. Oh, go fares on the taxi. I do think they um, they they did make the kind of go to gate and things a lot earlier. Yeah. Um, which which definitely helps. Well, we will be having this beautiful go fare coming over here in the next few minutes probably going to get in the way of the uh the singapore when it comes probably. in to be honest but hey i'll take that morning tony yeah. oh, do you know what mark i'd, I'd love a royal jordanian here i oh. love that that would make me happy I just want that special. Oh, the one that I got? Yeah, well, the one that I was... Uh, in terrible light. Yeah, well, it was actually good light on the airfield. I was actually outside at the time and it came in and uh, we just weren't... We literally just got to the spot where we were going to set up and I was just like, oh. Didn't have a chance to get it on my iPhone, to be honest. I would I, I was trying to say, I would have just got my iPhone and I would have been happy as Larry. Yeah. That's life. A muffin is a cake thing. Muffin is my belly. <laughs> Ian as well, so it's a muffin. Well, what, right, I have to ask then, right, for the people that call, like, the, the you know, the bready, balmy, rolly, cobby things, uh, for those that call it a muffin, what do you call the, the cake-like structure with, like, chocolate chips or blueberries in or something? Because isn't there a confusion there? Oh, she's just done you there, aren't uh-huh. she? Well, I'm just curious. When, when someone says to you, ah, oh, just, just nip to the shop and just get us some muffins... What, what are you buying? Are you buying cakes? Are you buying bread? Yeah, what do you call a blueberry? Exactly. Chocolate chip. What do you call those? They're not, not, people aren't going to like that unless you're doing that. Well, I'm genuinely this, this curious. Deba- this, this deba- Again, I'm this genuinely curious now. This, this, you know, people talk about, you know, what was the cause of certain wars and stuff like that and... <laughs> This one's caused more wars than any other debate. Especially on Facebook. Facebook's like has to create oh, filters where it's, everyone mentions a bomb or bar cake. They just they delete the profile. Ah, oh, thanks, Mike. Um, that ATR should probably should be due about 11. Last time I looked, it hadn't even set off yet. But, um... Michael saying, I was born in Texas, but raised in upstate New York. Most can't tell where I'm from, uh, but when I'm in Texas, the Texas, Texas accent comes out. Yeah. Um, oh, has the golf first stopped? <laughs> it's stopped. There's something coming in. No, 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 he's, oh, he's no. crossed the runway. Oh, well, the Singapore has I think, just I turned think he's on been the in, finals. I, I don't know, but I think he's been instructed to go down one of the taxiways and he's like going, no, I want to go straight down. <laughs> and he's, he's probably going back on the radio, uh, do you mind if we go straight down? And hopefully if we have a wonderful ATC, you know, they'll go, go down to the taxiway where Simon and Liz are. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, have a good day, Big All. Enjoy your uh, 37th wedding anniversary. I can't even say wedding. I think yeah, anniversary. Absolutely, you know what, I, you know, what I, I don't normally say that what I just say is true, but I think that's the case because he has, is actually turning down the side taxiway. I don't think they're particularly happy on board at the moment there. <laughs> that flight deck is like going, I wanted to go straight down. 
and he was expecting that. <laughs> yeah, so they're doing a... OK, he's going straight now. OK, so I think they've said, like, we can't make that turn. And can we go straight? And I think they've been told that they can. Uh, Chris, we will... Oh, it is turning. Sorry. At latest, check the Facebook messages tomorrow. I'll try later. Oh, um, is it the one, the, the thing I suppose... It, we've just been really busy. Uh, yeah. It's the one that, is that... Oh, one? yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Simon... Right, yeah. I actually Simon. know which one it is. Um, I, we have just been really busy. Don't, be, don't worry. You, you are on Simon's to-do list. Yes. Yeah, you are actually on the checklist. Um, so don't worry. I will get round to it. I have put you on there. It's just that we've got about... We've got a lot to do, so uh, you, got, you understand we've got other... Th we do have other things. We're not full-timers when they're doing this, so uh, we have to balance it out. Yes. Uh, Chris, we're good. Morning. Right, yeah, just forget that tax away. Keep yeah. going quicker and come down here. Oh, well, I hope you enjoy this uh, week on the... Uh, I'm just going to get a recording this. Path. Yep. He doesn't want to do these turns. <laughs> Things at Stockport. I'm, I'm, I'm on this one. I'm sorry, this is entertaining. <laughs> He's literally going to every point and just going, I don't really want to do this turn. Uh, do you have a better turn for me? And he's like going, <laughs> you mean you want me to go to the next one and do a tighter turn? Yeah, I think he is. I think he might be coming down here in front of us. <laughs> he's, having a he's having a nightmare off here. He's like, oh, I don't want to do this. Right, this is going to be the best moment ever in aviation because this is coming right down in front of us. So I am going to ask for mics off on this one. Yeah. Oh, this. Is he going to have to backtrack? Unless he comes down this next one. Oh, if he comes down there, this is the internet. The internet's destroyed. Turn. No, he's turning back. Going back. Wowzers. Okay. Okay, that's, uh, that's a little bit different. I'll have to try and find out what that was. And Singapore's just landed, of course, but I won't lie, this is entertainment for us at the moment. <laughs> millimetre pan going onto another plane that was really right in front of us. It's a bit ugly that but hey it's fun. This is this is fun at the moment. If anyone's on uh, a scanner at the moment you know, can you let us know what's happening? That'd be great. All right Chris good morning nice of you to pop in. That's up. Glad to hear that you've almost got 11 days off. Definitely. But yeah, if you pop down, do come and say hello. Yeah. I think he might be coming straight back around. I just don't think he was happy making the turns onto the taxiway. He just, I don't know. We don't know what's been happening. We'll but, find uh, out. We will find out. If he goes straight back over and goes back to gate, then he obviously he's going back to gate. But um, if he goes back... And then comes back across. He obviously just wasn't happy with the turn. It's fun anyway. It gives us something to talk about. Yeah, exactly. And I will try and find out where what happened later as well.
Oh, I can hear uh, an ATR. Mm -hmm. Benedict has strong views on uh, calling a, a bread something bready a muffin. <laughs> Wowzers. Uh, I think we started uh, World War Seven here. I think Putin would be proud of us. <laughs> Right, Bev, why are they picking on you? If it's because you call something other than a bomb. Hang on. <laughs> we have the greatest bread community in aviation. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, Nick, I wasn't going to bring in uh, a breakfast biscuit. <laughs> oh, no. Why'd you do that? Oh, it's going straight back to gate. Oh, wait. Now he's having a think. <laughs> that Singapore. So do you want to go back that... to Bahrain or do you want to stay in Manchester? I don't know what's happening. I, do you I'm, know what's I'm, happened? I'm, I have no idea what's happened, but. Do you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw this out there, right? Uh, they went to uh, they went to pick up some soft bread. To make a sandwich with, they and have unfortunately, no bomb cakes on board. well, no, unfortunately, someone told them to go and get some muffins, and now they have the wrong type of food on board because they brought back cakes with chocolate chips in them. Someone's got and allergies. And now no one can make a sandwich. Someone's got allergies as well, <laughs> and it means that the flight is in jeopardy if it didn't go off. We're just making this up, people. By the way, <laughs> we have no idea what's happening. But it's uh, also happens. Hopefully, it's nothing. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's anything too serious because if it, if it was a medical, I would have, I would have guessed that it would have gone straight to gate. That's true. Um, there might be a couple of uh, tech issues. No, you see, the English muffin, the ones that you make like eggs Benedict out of, that to me is like a completely separate thing. You don't make a sandwich out of one of them. I do like an oven bottom muffin though. But that's technically a bomb. <gasps> oh god, but... look Liz, you're contradicting yourself at the best of times. No, time. I know, stop it. I just like stop them. Stop it, just stop it. Like, <laughs> don't go there. Oh dear, uh, Top Aviation, good morning. <laughs> good morning. I don't know what carnage you've come into today, mate, but <laughs> going back to gate. Yeah. Right, we've got British Airways about to land. It's an A321 Neo from London Heathrow. Excellent. Well, I'm going to stay on this CRJ. Coming in behind that, we've got an easy jet from Amsterdam. It's an A320. Well, we enjoyed the chaos that was Gulf Air. I won't be going out for a fair old while yet, are we? Any guess now? No, the BA's behind it, you can see it. There you go, coming in the shot. Have the Aer Lingus ATR, and it looks like it wants to go already. Let's get on that. <laughs> they have a guided tour of the airport. Maybe they were. But, but you didn't think you were going to get that free of charge on your flight when you booked it. <laughs> exactly. Gone back to Dublin. Mm. 
Good morning, Catherine. Hope you're well. Absolutely. Right. right let's see what this is going to do. Oh, we'll get the easy jet first, actually. Jump on that. Hopefully, it should make a turn to go back onto stand by then. Go far. All I can see in the chat is prof emojis <laughs> and, bread, and bread discussion. <laughs> to be honest, it's more it is a muffin bread or is a muffin a cake. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, apart from that, the uh, Gulf Air thing's back on stand now. Okay. And um, we have Jet 2737 coming out. Good morning, Doros. Hope you're well. All right, well, so what we got going on? Come on. Oh, no, flight radar. Don't crash on me now. Oh, it's crashed on you again. Someone's unplugged it again. Oh, no. Oh, my app's not working. Ah. I just... <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. You've unplugged it again. Sweden then just, like... Got a massive power cut again. Oh, dear me. Oh, well. Mike, what's happening? <laughs> Keep me updated, please. <laughs> okay, well, the last one we got is this is KLM and Sky Team Liver on approach, uh, approaching the East Coast. So that's doing 25 minutes. Well, that's something. <laughs> well, that's uh, not make it easier for Liz. When the plane lands, that's when she knows there's the next plane. Right, we've got a jet to, to Larnaca taxi now. You mean this one that's on the runway? You've got to remember a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bit of a delay. I'm going to throw something else in there. We can at least all agree that crumpets are brilliant. There's no, no one in Ireland on a crumpet, is there? You know exactly what a crumpet is. I know exactly what a crumpet is. Okay, flight radar's back. Whew! There's a right now an approach from Knock. Not Knock. Who's that? Knock. Oh. Right now. <laughs> right now who? That's a land. <laughs> that was terrible. As, as jokes go on this channel, that was the worst. <laughs> I don't think so. Trust me, I've heard some real shockers on it. <laughs> okay, we'll stick. We'll keep on the tower for a minute, and then we'll uh, get the rain out as it uh, arrives. arrives. Good morning, Amy. Having to put the shades up in the tower because it's. Uh, it's so sunny. It's refreshing. Yeah. And then the, like, forgive me for asking this because I'm on 144p. I'm not lucky enough to be able to use it 4k like everybody. Is that in the top bit? Yeah. On the right hand side. Okay. You can move. And they were on. expensive blinds, weren't they? Well, I think. Oh, no, these blinds made to measure. They cost a fortune, don't, don't they? I don't think they're, are they blinds per se. Are they blinds? 
Well, they're going to be blinds of some sort, aren't they? Well, you don't know they could, like, put, you know, with these, the glass that they have at these places. Oh, that's true. Like, tinted glass. Yeah, it could be specific. We should all have that. That should just be, like, just standard. pay for it, Liz. You know, if you want to. Do you know what? I would, but, um... I live in a listed building, so uh, can't can't just do these kinds of things. Oh, well, that's just excuses, excuses, excuses with you. <laughs> I, know. Oh, I can see the rain now. It's about to uh, pop into shot any second now. Uh, Kirsty, good morning. I got stone eight oh eight. eight oh eight. I love it. Crumpet. Uh, not sure, Josh. All we know is that it went back to stand. Oh, what is? What's wrong with crumpets with Marmite? Oh, that guy is sick. Jeez. I don't mean like in a good way. I mean like go and see your doctor way kind of thing. <laughs> Morning, Birchie. Um, we have the Air France going over, but I'm before that I'm jumping on. Yeah, I just got Carlos there. Oh, we got another one. Wait a minute. Oh, Beth said they do crumpet thins now as well, because they do like them thin bread thins, don't oh, they? Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, my camera won't focus though. Oh, I had that as well. That's disgusting. I had that on Carlos for a good old while there. I was, they, I don't even think he knows where he's flying. I don't think a crumpet thin's going to be as good because you know you want all the butter to like seep through, and it needs to be switchy. Oh, <laughs> kind of same question. Do we have a, a bread or muffin emoji here? No. Well, no, but it's funny to say that because uh, if we want to want to test our uh, sound, we should go toast. Toast. Yeah, go toast. <laughs> All right, Garrett, I've never tried crumpet with cheese, but I always hear good things about it, but to me, they just don't go together. No, I could see that working, but as I say, I'm, I'm, I, I'm just here for the crumpets on their own, to be honest. Yeah, simplicity. Oh, Emirates has pushed. Oh. Not early. No, it's no. 10 o'clock. Time flies, eh? I think it's 10 o'clock. It's 10.01, actually. Oh, well, sorry, Liz. <laughs> There's an Iberia Express on at finals from Madrid. But yep, Emirates A384, Dubai. Should we see what the weather's like over there? No. No, I don't, I don't think you want to torture yourself. You, you seem to have been wanting to do this. Well, it doesn't matter because when I go on Twitter, all I see is about the weather in other countries anyway. It's going to be 31 there today. France heading back to Paris. Thank you, John. I will. Uh, I know Simon will be keeping an eye out for the Brussels uh, Tomorrowland livery. Oh, I will. I know oh, that thing looks people. absolutely delightful with heat haze because I remember the first shot I ever got of that was heat haze central. You could stay at the departure and then uh, you wouldn't have it in heat haze. That's mm. what? You could stay for the departure and then you wouldn't. No, I mean, I've got it. I'm not a big fan of the livery, to be fair. <laughs> I've, bought, I've, I've bought it. I've you caught bought, it. Oh, she's bought it. Oh. I said I've caught it, but since then. You'll be buying followers next. <laughs> oh, I don't need to do that. We've got the Iberia Express now. It's about to uh, touch down. Uh, morning, Laura. Good to have you to join us. Just before work, I think you should just stay with us. Forget work. Yeah, work's <laughs> overrated. I think plane safety free. Oh, crumpets with a, a runny poached egg. I feel, like I, I feel like I talk about poached eggs every time we go live. And the fact that I've never had a poached egg. 
Well, I think you need to uh, open your eyes. I know. You got all the stuff for it. What, a pan and an egg? Uh, white wine vinegar. Oh, OK. Good morning, Steve. Got into the Emirates. Yeah, I apologise if I'm making any. Well, if we're all making anyone hungry, uh, I don't. Mind. I'm starving, so I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm. I think you lot all need to sort <laughs> yourselves out. Yeah, to be fair, Bev, you got to leave crumpets for ages anyway before they actually go a bit like crispy. Awesome, Catherine. Sent just back from uh, Belfast. I bought some. I don't even know what a treacle fall is. Oh, I love fall. And wheat and bread, home with it. Yeah, proper bread that. <laughs> well, what, is it right? So it's a type of bread. Yeah. All right. There's Mike. Uh, I was going to say, I can do it with this one if you want. I'm just giving you it now. So. Okay, I'm now... And I have two charges. <laughs> oh. You can finally say you're connected. Thanks. Oh, you can hear the A380 starting up. Yes, we can. Well, the way the weather is today, the only A380 goes out, we'll be able to do extended departures, so uh, that's something to look forward to. And hopefully we get a couple of uh, tight turns, yeah. meaning that we'll have the plane come over the airfield. Awesome. <laughs> I, had to, I had to see what Jenny said about food, because everyone was like, oh my God, what's wrong with you? Uh, Marmite with marmalade on toast. Oh, what? That is quite the combo. <laughs> that is not good. At least it's all the M's, Marmite and marmalade. Yeah, um, yeah, I'm, I'm just going. I'm here on. for the alliteration. Yeah, not for the taste. Uh, no, no, I don't. I, I don't really like it. I no, not a fan. Good morning, Esther. I know what time. What time do you call this? Some of us been up for hours. Good morning, Warren. Well, good evening to you, Warren, down in Sydney. Oh, it's great to have you with us. Enjoying your evening over there? Absolutely. There's a Ryanair um, at the end of 2-3 left, but... It's, uh, it's not coming on yet, so we'll just keep an eye on this Emirates. As soon as uh, this one moves, we'll go on to that. Oh, come on, flight radar. Oh, I want to know where that Ryanair's going. Did you say it's a Ryanair? The one at the end of the runway? Yeah. Yeah, it's coming on now anyway. There we go. Uh, that is going to Tenerife. Hey, Tenerife's quite nice today. Oh, I just I think the spinny circle is me because my flight radar just wasn't working. So. Yeah, it's not me. I'll just double check. Yeah, we're going in really good numbers, so no, okay, it's not me. Okay, so it's me then. Just having a, a mare. As I say, we noticed that there has been some uh, issues around here on this point recently, but 
seem to be running at a good, very good bit rate today, so uh, should be us. Uh, Alan, let me try and find where that flight is. I found that flight, the Ryanair that's pushed back over there. Sorry, what are you on about? The Ryanair that's pushed back over there. What about it? I can't see. Oh, yeah, there's one that's pushed, yeah, what about it? Uh, Alan's daughter is on it. Okay, that's cool. Well, going yeah, to Budapest. Emirates A380 is going to be going out first, so. Perfect. And I'm guessing even if that one gets over here, it's going to have to wait three minutes. Yeah. Got to uh, move over. I've got some uh, letter cleaners, uh, some people who are kindly coming down to uh, clear. Oh, I've got a bag of rubbish here well, as well. Well, yeah, it's an interesting point because when we turned up here, there was about three McDonald's dinners on the floor here, so we've had to clear up. So if you are down here... Please take your rubbish back with take, you. It doesn't take much. And it seems to be a repeat offender because there was the same McDonald's on Monday as well in the exactly. exact same spot uh, which we moved. Exactly. Good morning, Lindsay. Yeah, we're not saying it's necessarily, you know, spotters or anything either. I don't think it is spotters. I don't think it is. I, I know a lot of people just sort of come down. Just coming down and... Uh, they're just doing the same, but it's lovely to see that some people are coming out to actually do that. Absolutely. I'm just saying, we do have the uh, Emirates A380 now uh, crossing the runway. Yeah, Oh, wow, there's loads of people. Yeah. Shout out to all of them. Uh, morning, Randy. Yep, the Emirates is uh, ready to go. If my internet wants to work. <laughs> I think uh, everybody, I will get back to the chat as soon as I can. My uh, my internet's died a death. Well, we just had the Eugene touchdown behind it. But we're going to stay on the Emirates because it's big. Getting the grill of the A380. You're rebooting. I'll do it after this has gone, to be honest. I think that's probably yeah. the better idea. I would say so. All right. Um, there we go. All right. Just don't move, Liz. Right, let's get this Emirates 380 going out.
Well, but I know gonna... I know that the Ryanair can't go out for this until the wait turbulence yeah. dissipates. So uh, I'm, I'm... going to just restart my phone because uh... yeah. All right, so there's a possibility the internet might go down on this, but there's not just a possibility we need you need your phone, so yeah. do it. That's cool. Should be, we've got enough internet to cover it, so don't worry. The joys of technology, though. Someone pulled the plug out over here as well. <laughs> very, very probably. So, yeah, I think it's almost like um, it jumps onto, like, one of the other towers or something and it just doesn't like it at all. I mean, there is one tower that's down isn't there at the mm. moment so we are aware of that. I've oh, got the nice biz jet lining up but as I say it can't take off until the weight turbulence caused by this baby's uh, disappear dissipated. As I say we will get that 737 for the uh, person whose daughter's on it. Right, I'm back in the room. <coughs> oh gosh, I nip away. I well, I'm guessing you have a lot of A380 emojis. A380 emojis. Okay. Got, uh, Carwin, who has gifted five memberships. Oh, thank you so much, Carwin. That is amazing. Thank you so much. I do appreciate your support of the channel, mate. It's you have epic. just top man. If you have just received one of those, please do say thank you if you're in the chat. <coughs> it's going quite north for its, uh, for its making its banking turn back towards the east. And uh, the, also the wonderful Joe. Mr. Joe Biden chat. Dollar super chat saying, happy Wednesday, Simon and Liz. Uh, just popping in and out. Uh, still under the weather. Love you lots. Well, oh, honestly, mate. I really hope you are feeling better soon. Yeah, you've had this for a little while now, haven't you? So take care of yourself, mate. Absolutely. Thank you for your support. Absolutely amazing. Um, <coughs> right, what I'm going to say is I'm just gonna, I'll just read the super chats and then I'm going to go back through the chat just because obviously my internet's been dodgy. I don't want to well, lose I'm them. Part just well, we'll get this. But well, this isn't the Ryanair, this is the bitch chat. Okay. Here's the Ryanair that that person's daughter's on. Awesome. Well, right. Definitely on that. I'm guessing. Got the uh, air behind it. Uh, e. Peterson, thank you so much for the $25 super chat. So, oh. And uh, also, happy Wednesday. Uh, although it's, uh, uh, it's still Tuesday here in Hawaii. I think you mean Tuesday, not Thursday. I think someone's enjoying themselves in Hawaii there. But uh, thank just you so much bit. for your support then. Thank you. Amazing. Um, I'm going to just uh, quickly flick through the chat, see if I've missed anything. I don't like to miss things. Right, Emirates emojis. Lots of them. <laughs> I don't see the Emirates anymore. Is that what I can hear, though? Yeah. Right, anyway, let's get this right now. Awesome. There you go. Uh, Mr. Pingus, you, you'll, um, airlines will record a pushback time at uh, the time it actually starts pushing back, and then they'll record also the, there'll be a recording of the uh, actual takeoff time as well. 
So we've got a little bit of busy time again um, here at Manchester. We've uh, three or four planes. All ready to go. Oh, well, Matt, I hope you uh, managed to catch the A380 going past your window. Sorry. Thanks, Les. Sorry? Tomorrowland. Oh, sorry. That's my bad. I do apologise. You've also got the Kalem Sky team behind that. Oh. Well, I'll tell you what, it's taken a, bit, a while to vacate here. Eh? Well, we will get on the way out. Okay, let's get the Sky Team uh, livery. KLM. Touching down. We push behind this right now. There we go. Oh, it's the one with the blue nose. Oh. Did not need to see this one again. I love KLM, but that random, please, 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 please <laughs> swap it over. It just doesn't look good. I like that livery as well, that's the thing. Yeah, exactly. Good morning, Eric. Hope you're well today. Oh, sorry, Mike. I just saw you. <laughs> sorry, Mike. I, 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 can't, I can't work with this. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mike. He really was shouting at me. <laughs> Loads of comments. <laughs> oh, dear. Mike, I'm taking the Fifth Amendment, mate. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> oh, dear. Morning, Darren. I hope you're well. Concord Landing. Concord Landing. Let's Concord Landing. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, this is Freddie Mercury. Good morning. Great to have you in the chat. As I say, we will get that on the way out, so it's not going to be the biggest... Not going to be the end of the world, is it? No. Usually has a pretty quick turnaround as well, doesn't it? Yes, they do, so it's... You know, it's uh... Yeah, you can you scare Carlos off, he's been antisocial today. <laughs> it's 
uh, due back out in 40 minutes. That's uh, Brussels. That little, uh, uh, what's it? That, um, what's the name of it now? That, that little BRA ATR? Yeah, the bra. The bra. Hey, bra. Uh, ATR 76, so uh, due 11.07. Well, we'll get that. I oh, well, fancy getting it going out as well, to be honest. We'll see how it goes. Due, what time is it due back out? 12. Just before 12. It's a short turnaround. Okay. So it'll be the time the Emirates comes in, so... Well, it's estimating 11.50. Oh, what time does the Emirates come in? I don't know, I'm having a look. I yeah, think I'm it was not. about... It was a bit late, actually. I don't know if it's made any time up. Twelve oh seven. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Fancy staying for that? Then get your Greggs. Well, you won me over with the Greggs. There we go, so we're all sorted now, people. There's our time, we're gonna cut off then. Right, it's heading back to Copenhagen. Uh, Davy, good morning. Hope you're doing well. So we've got a two Dreamliner out, and we have a two seven two seven six seven. Uh, it's just uh, started its taxi towards us, so uh, I should be here in a moment. I think this Jet Two is going to come on before that two, though. So we'll jump onto that and get in there, grill. All right, so this is going to be going up to Lanzarote. And the uh, Tui for Cancun. Excellent. Go. Go. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Transat A321 Neo from Toronto. Uh, almost here, it's just at Cheadle. Excellent, I'll uh, get this one rotating and I'll jump down there. Oh, I've said that, we've got two Dreamliner, that's got to take precedent. That Jet 2 run it to the red zone as it rotates off uh, runway 23 left. Oh, well, Warren, I'm, I hope you enjoy your gifted membership. Exactly. It's so great. We've got so many kind benefactors who uh, want to help us support the channel. So thank you. As you say, this... Uh, we're streaming in true 4K, so you can really get in there and crop. Just change your uh, thing over to 2160. Oh, it's like when we got that beluga going overhead the other day. Oh, oh my. Probably the best footage. Like, it's ready for a reel to go out of it as well, and it is. it looks stunning, the footage, I won't lie. Yeah. Um, it's one of the benefits of doing it properly. Oh, someone's trying again to go out. No. Second time lucky. And the air transat's touching down. Let's grab that. Darren, I was telling Paul yesterday he needs to book a, a nice long haul business class flight with a long, uh, nice life lap bed. <laughs> Bet you Vicky's thinking, where's my ticket? Well, yeah, that's true. <laughs> 
That's why you don't want to. That's why he's like, no, I'll just do. I'll do all the short hops. You don't want to come. <laughs> that's too much. Thank you, Mike. That, uh, the, the, the bra prop plane uh, over Northumberland. That oh, shouldn't be too long before he gets here. You're mad, Paul. You're mad. Just go on one nice long flight. Just enjoy it. I would, like, you could do a nice chill vlog then. You could like, do like, this is what I'm eating. I have to rush when I get off. Paul, it sounds like she wants to just get rid of you as far away as possible, <laughs> to be honest. Just saying, mate. You just do what you want to... Just think how like, less stressful it would be. I don't know how you do it. I really don't. No, that one looked quite stressful, didn't it, to be honest? Yeah, he said he wants to do more in a short period of time. Well, I mean, it, it, that's, if he feels like he's up to it, then absolutely. But as I say, it's, uh, it takes a lot out of you. I don't. Wanna, I don't feel like I like. I don't even like doing long haul flights or anything now with a, a stopover somewhere or anything kind of short. Like, I don't feel like I don't want to have to like limber up before I go flying. <laughs> no, that's true. That's true. But, uh, there's those worse problems to have though, aren't there? I mean, oh yeah. It must have been a little bit dodgy where he was like sleeping over in the airports and stuff like that in Milan, and you know, it's not a great, not the greatest feeling in the world, is no. it? I remember, Paul, next time if you're flying from Manchester, you let us know so we can, like, pick you up and drop you off, mate. Yeah, exactly. I'll save you a few quid. OK, so behind this um, right now, we do have the 2767 now we're awaiting to uh, depart. So, uh, yeah, stick around with us. We also have the Gulf Air uh, that's pushed. And behind that, we do have a Jet 2. It looks from here, because there's so much heat haze, looks like an A321, but I can't be sure. But uh, do you know what? Probably, I was going to say, probably good to look at flight radar, but the thing is, this plane's departing, so. Mr. Pingo, I'll tell you what, drop me an email. Um, I think you, you've got our email, you've emailed us before. Drop us an email with those kinds of questions and I will respond to you uh, in the next couple of days when I get a minute and then you've got something to refer back to. Uh, I know you have problems with your memory and stuff. So... We have this uh, 276 ready to go. Yeah, it's short. Uh, yeah, I mean, it always works better, doesn't it, as well as yeah. an email. Then we can just, like, put concise points to you and stuff like that. So, yeah, absolutely. Happy to do that. All right, we've got Turkish not far away as well now. Excellent. Thanks, Mike. Arrival, we've got uh, another lot of biz jets, a Cessna 510 Citation Mustang, and uh, that's coming from Munich. Excellent. And uh, then, as Mike said, we've got the uh, Turkish A330 from Istanbul. Okay, let's get this right now. 
And as you'll see in a moment, the golf air is right behind... Well, it's about to cross over. Runway one here at Manchester. Will it go this time? Oh, we'll see what happens. I'm not <laughs> going to rule anything out after what happened before. And say it crossed over the runway. And then... Uh, well, we don't know what happened, but it, this, it just didn't want to go anywhere apart from straight down. But uh, went back to stand and then come out a little bit later. It's a really nice day today. I really wasn't expecting it to be this nice. Like, I'm sure I looked at the weather yesterday and it said it was just going to be cloudy. Yeah, absolutely. Apparently that just means sunshine now. Well, I I, I was looking at Simon Lowe's stream yesterday and, it, you know, we had the same kind of weather forecast. Yeah, um, true. And it was really nice sunny day, so I'm not sure, to be honest. Uh, I'm not trusting them at the moment. No, neither and, am I. Uh, I mean, I know they go, they go, seem to go through the phases of being really bad. Oh, God, really diddy biz jet air coming in. Yeah, it's one from Munich. Is that the one from Munich? Well, all I can say is I can barely see it. Luckily, I've got 900 millimetre of... Uh... It's going to pop out of this left side any second now. There, <laughs> there's a bump where you can... I think that just shows people how big the bump is here at Manchester. Um, the bump that pilots talk about. Good morning, Sebastian. <laughs> Eric's saying, love a, a citation Mustang. Mustang, Mustang, part two, one, eight, four, seven, six, four, eight, two, three. Is that your favourite? <laughs> That's the one. That's the one. Right, what we're going to do is we're going to jump onto this right now. Uh, it looks like it's going to be coming on right in front of us, which is cool. That right now, it's going to be going to Barcelona. I think it's quite cool how you watch pilots, you know, how they turn onto the runway very differently to one another. Mm. Some like to uh, draw left and then turn back onto the runway. And some just like just turn Get it on normally. There. <laughs> And the Gulf Air is finally coming towards us. Yay! <laughs> exactly, I think that is a big yay. So basically, they did um, they did have the wrong type of bread on board. They had cakes on board, they had muffins oh, on board. Oh, don't be starting that again. <laughs> oh, what are you doing, Liz? Can I unplug this now, by the way? Yeah, of course you can. Let's hold still, hold still, hold still. Sorry? See that iconic flex in a minute. Well, it's second time lucky for that Dreamliner. That Absolutely. Heading back to Bahrain. 
Uh, next time we'll have a Turkish. A330? Yep, it's uh, just approaching G dot. Excellent. Well, what we'll do is, I'll just turn the record button off. Is that's that's always a good thing. I will. Uh, I'll do an extended departure on it when it gets to healed. Can you give me a shout? Yes, I can. I'm sure, everyone loves that livery on that plane. It's gorgeous. So it'll get towards Knutsford and then go. Oh, but I can't go. I can't fly over there. <laughs> it's bank right. Should be any second now. There we go. Turkish at Hillgrim. Okay, let's get on to that. And we have a Tui crossing the runway as well once uh, this Turkish comes in. I'm just waiting for that. Mike doesn't have to shout at me. Oh, about, about time. I know. <laughs> He Hayes is getting up quite hard. It's going to be an interesting summer here, isn't it? Oh, it is. I mean, we're all going to work in our tans, but I think we're going to have to be very strategic with our spots in order to minimise minimize that. Minimise? Yeah, that's uh, up at 4.30 word, that one. <laughs> that was quiet. Well, I was on it for an A330. Oh, thanks, Beth. So can I just say great sound on the stream? Random. Uh, I no, know that's we'll me. take that. I'll Absolutely. take the randomness. Trust me, I'm far more random than that. Yeah. So, okay, that's so. still. Very iconic tale of uh, Turkish Airlines. Right. Tui is now coming over here. It's got a Jet 2 behind it as well. Two, both 737s. Let's see where they're going. Uh, Larnaca. Larnaca. And uh, Force of Ensura. Excellent. Well. And Force got a Rona pinged up for Alicante as well. It's a here. <laughs> Karen said uh, the sound of that thermos uh, being done it reminds me so much of being a kid uh, a very <laughs> long time ago um, that Karen put the emphasis on very not me and um, oh, I was glad about that <laughs> I was so brutal to people in Charlotte <laughs> uh, mine was a light blue and made the exact same sound weird yeah. how things take you back well ours is dark blue so, yeah it is nostalgic but yeah I get it? that Okay, let's get this Tui departing. Uh, morning, John. Saying hi, guys. In work, loving the sun outside, watching planes on the approach from Middleton. Oh, okay, that's not too bad. That's awesome. Uh, 
one called Lanzarote. <laughs> uh, so, Daryl, that um, <laughs> the front end of the monarch plane is it literally just that. It's uh, set the runway visit. I can't even say it. Run away, visit a park. Yeah, I can't say that today. Um, they use it for like tours and um, talks and things about it. Um, I'm guessing they didn't get the whole thing because of space. <laughs> yeah, and that's why they went for the front end. Oh, there you go, it's cockpit experience. Thank you, Paul. You know more than I do. All right, I can see uh, now, like I say, TL72 from at Belfast just turning on to finals. Excellent. And oh, there's the bra. Uh, up, uh, I'm trying to find something that it's near. Uh, north. Wow, your your descriptions are so apt. No, near Settle. There you go. Thanks, Liz. Sorry, I was just trying. Yeah, I was trying to find something that you might know at least. Well, I'm I'm in the ballpark. I, I get where you're coming from now. Okay. far away now uh, before we get that as I say we've got the Erlingus A330 now pinging awesome is that for Orlando uh, Bridgetown Bridgetown awesome like that uh, this ATR can be the winner first of four ATRs first of four ATR 72s inbound I hope you like your props I think it's going to be some serious propage. Propage. And there is the Turkish just going around the back now. And didn't that Paul? Paul's saying uh, that Turkish didn't look like it even used reverse thrust. No. No? I don't oh. think it did. Oh, efficient. I mean, that'll explain why do it was that. quiet. Oh, yeah. I mean, I I'll explain why it was so quiet then. Yeah. It's, uh, Are we just all so used to, like, Ryanair just, like, slam on and stop as quick as possible? Well, it's the Emirates as well, isn't it? Yeah, it's, that's true. Um, it does make a bit of a, a racket. It does. Do you want something? Just one. Just one for a sec. Oh. I'll explain later. That well, reminds me, I need to do a couple of checks. That's good. So, Turkish is now going on the stand that the... Uh, it looks like it anyway, it looks like it's going on the stand that the... Uh, Gulf Air was on. I was lucky that that got moved. It was, yeah. Oh, Esther was going to tell us all the funniest joke ever, but she's forgotten it. Oh wow, that is that, that, that's the funniest thing joke she's ever told in this chat. To be <laughs> honest, so uh, well done, Esther. Your joke skills are improving. Got some overhead that's quite loud. I'm just trying to see what it is. I'm trying to see where it is first. And... Nope, I can't see that at all. So unlucky, everyone. Otherwise, we could have had a bit of overhead love there. Oh, well. well you have to not... listen to it instead. Yeah, well, it was ne it was never going to kind of uh, surpass what happened on our last show, was it? In regards of the... Uh, oh, the beluga. The beluga. The beluga footage was amazing. Like, I've got a screenshot of it, and I won't like... Even if I took a shot of my... You know, just doing photos of it, it wouldn't have been as good as that. Yeah. How good the footage was. So, uh, yeah, we were grateful for that. 
Okay, so uh, next arrival is now just past Stockport and heading towards Cheadle, so it should be here in under two minutes. That's an ATR-72. It's all about the ATR-72s now. It's the ATR-72 show, Liz. Uh, yeah, that's all going to rename it. I think we should. Well, between the two ATRs, we're going to have an EasyJet uh, coming in, and I think we'll probably get the Pegasus coming in just before that, so... Uh, Oh, I love the Pegasus. <laughs> you're, such a, you're such a Pegasus lover. Ah, awesome, uh, Karen. The uh, family wedding uh, I'm going to in Greece now has a date, 14th of July 2024. Oh, awesome. uh, Whilst away uh, for the UK, uh, but it'd be worth it after Greece. Uh, most excited about Devon. Oh, I can't, I've never even been to Devon, but... been to a lot of the countries, but you've never been to Devon. No, but I know a lot of people... Go on like staycations yeah. to Devon and stuff, so it must be good. Oh, but yeah, Greece is beautiful as well. I love Greece. Whereabouts in Greece is it, Karen? Where's all the planes gone? I've got an ATR coming in, that's why I'm down at the bottom of the. Uh, Aiming this at the bottom of the air, airfield. Oh no, flight radar, don't do this to me again. <laughs> That's why I've seen no planes. Flight radar, no. There it is. <gasps> the flight radar's gone again. Oh well. We'll give it a refresh. Well, I can tell you there's an easy jet during about five, ten minutes. Well, about three or four minutes, I should say. Ooh, bit of uh, action there as it touched down. It's quite dramatic. It was a bit wibbly wobbly. Wibbly wobbly? I thought it was a wibbly wobbly to be honest. Uh, uh, just north of uh, Athens. Very nice. You've been to Athens haven't I you? I certainly have. I loved it. I must say that the thing I thought about Athens was that you, you, you could tell that they'd, they'd been through a few years of economical struggle, you know, because uh, it was in some places it was pretty run down. Mm. But um, when was it you went? To, well, it was after the economic sh shutdown, so two thirteen, two fourteen. Okay. But um, I liked it. But I mean, we go to Greece quite well. I've been to Greece quite often. I like Greece. I've been once. <laughs> there you go. I liked it though. You love Corfu, didn't you? Little Corfu <sighs> action. Yeah. I actually know I've been twice, haven't I? Cause yeah, yeah, you've been to Santorini. Santorini as well, as well sorry. Paul, don't, don't waste the memory card space on doing a Pegasus vlog for me. <laughs> I see you got a Pegasus one, Liz. That's a yes. Oh, there we go. We're back on. I'm back on flight radar. Yeah, it's a bit. Old. I was about to say uh, Mike Radar. We need you. <laughs> Mike Radar 24, because he literally is on it 24/7. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness, oh, Why haven't we come up with that earlier? <laughs> got flight radar. I've got Mike Radar. So like that. Right. So <laughs> when's this next one landing? These jets should be next. Uh, just past Stockport, approaching Cheadle. Okay, I'll well, watch this Ryanair push back then. Okay. <laughs> no, I thought I'd be so excited to say Ryanair pushing back. Yeah, I agree, Andrew. I think the thing that it's really bad, one of the things that stands out most to me was the halloumi. A bit of uh, pesto on it. Oh, so good. I thought you meant the cat for a minute. No, not the cat. <laughs> I did like all the stray cats and dogs just wandering around there. <laughs> I went there and it was so windy to Santorini, didn't we? Oh, it was ridiculous. It was Apart so... from the day we were leaving, yeah. uh, where it was actually really uh, very nice, a beautiful day. But uh, yeah, it wasn't the best of weather, was it? But hey, got a couple of good shots though, didn't we? Oh, yeah. 
Well, Paul is my cheap mate, so, but I think, uh, <laughs> I did see that before, to be fair. Um, but I think Mike Radar 24 works as well. Yeah. <laughs> you got to tip, mate. You just t- if we're coming out the Saints for you, you just got to take him. Yeah. I bet every time he rocks into a chat nowadays, everyone will be calling him Mike Radar. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I can see the, our next arrival, which is an EasyJet. I think it's a Neo because I can hear it. And that's the thing with the Neos, you can uh, usually hear them before you... Uh... It is a Neo. Mm. The CFMs are very kind of distinctive. Well, considering that... Uh... Oh, sorry, I think they're on the move now, that Erlingus. I was going to say, like, what are they doing? I tell you what, last two planes have struggled with the landing, you know. Really? Even that one's wibbly wobbly. Wibbly wobbly? There's a wibbly wobbly on that one. <laughs> Not bouncy bouncy though. No bouncy bouncy, it's just, just wibbly wobbly. wobbly. Let's try to see what that windsock's doing. So the windsock is a crosswind as we speak, so it has got up to probably to about, well, it's not even saying 5 to 10. You get the occasional 10, but it's, uh, it's more than f- on the 5 side. Oh, uh, what have we got else have we got now? Coming in, going out. Anything. Anything. I know we've got the Ryanair that's about the taxi arch and we'll jump it back on this. Right, so jet. that Ryanair is the one for Alicante. We've got uh, a Tui Dreamliner for Montego Bay. We also have And the obviously Erlingus. the Erlingus for uh, Barbados taxi now. Yep. And on approach is the Pegasus. No, A321 Neo. From Istanbul, it's just passing Cheadle. Yep. Then, uh, Ryanair from Shannon, it's a 737. And, and then I also see that BRA 80 or 72 from uh, Stavanger, or Bra, however you say mate. it. Bra. <laughs> uh, there's also a Ryanair from Prague going to be coming. Okay, let's go down to the bottom of the runway. So, that A21 Neo is not too far away now. And uh, next Emirates, now in 15 away. It's currently, uh, is that still Germany there? I think it is still Germany. That's a shout, Liz. Yes, over Germany. Oh, I can see the Pegasus. I know this is the movement you've been waiting no. for all day. Can't wait. You just can't. I'm so excited. You Every time we mention Pegasus on this channel, Liz just goes, wow. Wow. There we go. <laughs> oh, stop, Paul. I think it's rude that there's still sunshine over there and not here. I think it's illegal. I, no, I'm not. I'm, I'm not having that. That's disgraceful. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Let's jump on the tail because Liz loves that that livery. I've still got the alert on this uh, Montego Bay flight from the other day when someone was on it, and I, I've forgotten how to switch alerts off. <laughs> so, what do you rate the app now? Well, this is just me. Oh, hang on. Is it in custom alerts? Oh, there it is. Delete. Uh, uh, oh, there we go. Bin it. There we go. <laughs> so, what we're going to do is we're going to move over to the Aer Lingus. Hopefully. Oh, do you know what? I've got a bad feeling the Aer Lingus is going to cover that bra, isn't it, as it comes up? Oh, I don't know. Hang on. Where's the shout on that? I think there is. Uh... Bra's just sort of uh, just before Hyde. Oh, quite a bit before Hyde, actually. Yeah, I right. think it's going to cover it, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, well. We'll get on the way out.
That is life. It's always the way when anything uh, different comes in or out of here. Yeah. That if heat haze out the back of the engines, oh, that livery looks amazing. <laughs> and you just roll your eyes and just go, oh, well. What are you going to do, eh? Can't do anything about it, can no, you? No, exactly. Well, the rider that we saw pushed back, that's crossed over and it's heading towards us, as well as the Aer Lingus. So uh, we're going to have some departure action for you very shortly. Go away for that. Oh, Karen, I hope, um, I hope the vets can figure out what's, uh, what's up with um, Tilly. It's always a worry with pets, isn't it, when they're not well? Yeah. Do you feel the temperature drop even when the sun's just like... Because we're not in a sunny spot because we've got the trees and stuff. But... I said that the sun's coming out again. Yay! Yay! <laughs> but you do, you do notice oh, it, don't you? It's really right weird. There, touching down. Yeah, it just, just slammed it the wrong way. So it's like, no messing around with me. None of these <laughs> floaty airbus landings. If smash it too hard, Tom will fix it. That's what he says. <laughs> There you go, I was talking about Holiday Pirates before, was, uh, I just got a notification on, uh, for a cruise, I feel talking about cruise, there's an eight night Mediterranean cruise. Uh, with, can you keep an eye on that bra please? Yep. The meals, flights and hotel for £678 That's per person. That. Just approaching Stockport. Got a Ryanair in first. Right, so the Aer Lingus is going to cross over and <laughs> get in the way. Well, if it gets a move on. No, it, it's not. It's literally the Aer Lingus is crossing the runway now. Okay. I think that thing's only about a minute out. Yeah, it? do you know what? I think it's a bit glitchy. Yeah, I, think I think it's a bit it, closer it, than it yeah, actually I, I, is. When I when I was looking at it last, it wasn't that far behind that Rhino, so... Yeah. Yeah, it's over Cheadle now. Yes, I thought so. Okay, well, we can focus You'll on... You'll get a great view. <laughs> get a great view on the way out. Exactly. <laughs> and true 4K over here today, so... Uh, Anyone who can really get in the faces of the pilots. Good morning, Max Bro. Hope you're well. It's uh, 8.06 in uh, Melbourne. 19 degrees. Wowzers. What a pleasant kind of temperature that is. Well, especially for the evening. Yeah. Okay, here it comes. Some different propage for you people. So what do you think of that tail? I think it's nice. It's uh, very different. I'm going to give my opinion in a minute when I can see it on the screen. Well, we will be jumping on the Aer Lingus in a minute. But we'll get a better view of this when it goes out.
I quite like that tail. I like it's a that bit different, one. isn't it? Yeah, I think it, it looks good. I think I'll get a good recording of that one when it goes out, but... Uh... Okay, we have another Ryanair touching down with one of company taxiing towards us. We'll jump on the one that's just landed. There we go. And we do have a Tui Dreamliner coming out towards us as well. It's still glitchy flight radar. There we go. Yeah, I don't think it's perfect. They, they, they're always a little bit glitchy as they start back up after, so yeah. I don't... I'm guessing they have quite a complex kind of start-up for the, getting their, all the servers back online. Yeah, I imagine so. so. It's not as simple as pressing a button. It's not. I mean, we were joking Alas. about it before, but uh, <laughs> it's, it, unfortunately it's not. That's why when they do tend to have issues, it does tend to last a few days. Even, yeah. You know, I mean, even this wasn't like this wasn't specifically a server issue, was it? This was a, there no, was a power was outage. The power outage, but the way that they have to reboot everything yeah. up. You know, if you don't get things in the right order, etc., sometimes you do get issues. So. Well, we don't want that, do we? No, we don't. <laughs> well, this Tui is for Montego Bay. I can't remember where that Ryanair was going. <laughs> there we go. Nice to meet you, Bob. Nice to see you nice guys. See Take care of yourselves. See ya. Have see a good ya. day. Oh, thank, thank you. you. See ya. Take care. So, here is the uh, Tui. Actually, it's identifying as I'm a Tui. I'm a Tui? I am. Oh, right. And it's got next to it Tui, so it's I'm Tui. Well, I'll let you identify as a Tui, because you are a Tui. Oh, awesome, uh, Diana, saying, uh, Hi, guys, great, great stream. Painting the garden fence, so having you in the background is great. Oh, wow, well, that's, uh, that's a bit different, isn't it? I didn't, I, I didn't think we were going to hear that one today, but I'll well, take that one. I beat the radio. At least you get to hear some engines as well. Good oh, stuff. Paul, nice to see you again. I, uh, I like that people go on uh, breaks at work and... Uh, pop in and they pop out. They pop in, yeah. Yeah, exactly. It's, uh, it's nice, isn't it? Though, they, yeah, uh, for... and uh, we have a new member, Dave Gardner. Welcome. Well, Dave, thank you so much for Thanks joining us. for signing up. Really appreciate that. And uh, David Carvin has gifted a membership. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you so, so much. much. That's awesome. As I say, that really does help us and uh, helps us to expand the community. So thank you so much for that. Yeah. We do really appreciate it. And I'm sure the person who's been gifted that membership will as well. Absolutely. Uh, I'm just thinking. Do I do? Oh, no, we've got an EasyJet coming over. I was going to say, do we do an extended departure on that one? No. Because we have two, uh, an EasyJet coming over. 
going to just refresh my uh, flight radar again. Oh, don't be doing that. It's tempting fate, that. No, it's, uh, it has gone off again, I think. Let me just try to take the filters off, see if that helps. Nope. Right. Mike Radar 24, where you at? <laughs> oh, awesome, uh, Dave. So Dave is our new member just now. Yes. Said that I had a free month gifted uh, great stream, so I had to renew. Oh, that's fantastic to hear. We absolutely love to hear that. That's amazing. That's the great thing about gifted memberships, isn't it? You know, it helps kind of like, you know, spread the word. Yeah. Uh, so, but yeah. We love it. Oh, that's awesome, Paul. So I can't think of doing anything better on my little tea break. Do you have biscuits with it as well? As oh. <laughs> I'm going down that road now. I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Morning, Kobe. Do I go after that, to- uh, that thing? No, I don't fancy that. Oh, I'll have it then. Oh, right. <laughs> let me, hang on, let me dig into the, the magical mystery bag of rain covers and snacks. Yeah, that's pretty much what it is nowadays. Sorry? That's pretty much what it is nowadays. Yeah. Oh, hang on, that's a Rice Krispie bar. No. That's crisps. Oh, I still haven't had them, have we? No. I was going to say they're here for a rainy day, but I don't think that's a, necessarily a good idea. Oh, I think someone's going to be having a long wait here. And they're going, it looks like they're going down to the bottom. Oh dear. The naughty corner, unless they turn off left here, if they turn this taxiway. Which they might do. You never know. Oh yeah, it seems to be slowing down. Yeah, so they're probably going to come down here. Oh, they're not that much on the naughty step. <laughs> yeah, the naughty slot step. You have to watch how you say things like that, I'll say. Oh, there it is. It's like right at the top. Oh, and I might have a bite, actually, then. Whoa! <laughs> where'd that come from? Well, now that I've got the caramel wafer in my hand, I'm kind of like, no, oh, go on then, I'll have a bite, I'll have a bite. Put the rubbish back in my bag. So this EasyJet um, is off to Geneva. There's a lot pinging at the back now. We've got uh, another EasyJet that's going from NA to NA. I'm guessing. Wow. The, I'm guessing one of the NAs is going to be Manchester. Yep. No, because if you want, well, depends who you want plane finder because it thought we were looting before. half of it I just no. like nibbles turn into half I'm sorry for the crunching. <laughs> I'll apologise in advance. Well, actually, retrospectively, I should be apologising. But we have Jet 2A321 coming out, so we'll grab that in a minute. And we have a Logan Air. I know from the red what it is. It's the ATR that's coming in. That's it. It's coming in right now. So let's get down there. Oh, thanks for tuning in, Mrs. Freddie Mercury. We'll see you on the next one. Absolutely. Have a great day. Darling, good morning to you in uh, Santa Ponza in Spain. Wow. It's 22 degrees over there. Sounds decent, that.
Ooh, very nice bitch jet coming over here now. Uh, it's Ali, that's awesome. What uh, what flight is she on? Or is she already taken off? Did we get her? Did I nail the pan? I feel nervous now. Air Charter Scotland. It's called G Sugar. Oh, don't tell me this is Alan Sugar's jet, is it? Google it. Uh, you'd have to check the reg on it. It's G, yeah. G S U G R. I mean, it's Air Charter Scotland, so I doubt it is, but that reg just sounds something that a certain... Hang on, what was it? G Sugar, S U G R. <laughs> sounds like it'd be uh, somebody's that they'd come up with. Well, it's Air Charter Scotland, so you can actually see the letter. A -O. Oh, I thought it was... I mistaken my Logan Air edges there. Ooh, that was not good. I need to check on those later. Oh, it. Ooh. Ooh. No, that's not that one. It's that one, isn't it? No, down sugar's G sugar. Yeah, that's it. G S U G. Yeah, that's yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, it is. Okay. Good shout on that one side. Was that in just now? It's there. All oh, right. This E jet looks like it's going to come on in front of it though. Yeah, it is. But we'll grab that. But I will get that as it departs. I can barely see the crew over there, but I will give a... Listen, you just go on 4K and just check if that is a long head pilot. What am I doing, sorry? Blonde hair in the left seat. Just double check. That is what, sorry? Can you... I didn't hear you. Okay, so left hand seat. Yeah. Can you just check if it was a pilot with blonde hair. I can't, I couldn't tell. I could only see like... Hang on, I need to just rewind. Of. Just a moment, Jet. And I'll get the Alan Sugar plane. It's all lined up now, so uh, I'm guessing that'll be the next one to go out. You'll have to go back and check, I can't Three see. Times, can you screenshot it? Well, I've screenshot this one, so... That is not a problemo. There we go. Enjoy this. So we have uh, a nice uh, problem here. Well, for us anyway. Got a few planes coming on via this taxiway here. Got, first of all, we have a Jet 2A321. Behind that, we have a Tap Portugal Embraer. And we're going to have at least, uh, I'll probably say at least one more coming down here because uh, we've got an easy jet making its way over. 
Oh, okay. So I hope, uh, I do hope Tommy feels better soon. I think Cal, at least Cal Paul hopefully is helping. Yeah. Um, but yeah, oh, um, it can't be an easy morning. Looks like they're all coming down here again, which is very nice. <laughs> Stop the like. Oh yeah, Kirsty, we're having a good stream. I'm, uh, I'm really enjoying How this. Are your pans? Best pans in the south. Because we're south side. <laughs> Enjoy, Matt. <laughs> oh, you yeah, have the tap and prayer. Uh, that's lined up, ready to go. Just waiting for sufficient clearance. Uh, we'll be getting a few more of these when we go to Feng Shao. Awesome. Taps, I'm not sure. Morning, David. Jump on it's a bit, a bit cool evening down in uh, Christchurch. Just a bit. Now, whatever's in the bushes next to me is not. <laughs> it's not a bird this time. That's making a racket. Uh, but have you missed much? Um, just the usual, really. So we've got a Logan our next in. I think it's actually just past Cheadle. Well, I'm just concentrating on what we've got in front of us, but thanks, cool. Liz. Uh, there'll be a uh, Pilatus coming in as well. Oh, we've got P Pilatus, did you say? Yeah. Okay. That's come from Jersey. Right, this uh, is just after Amsterdam. One that's just taken off. Uh, yeah, sorry. The it's one that's right, just then. taken off has gone to Amsterdam. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. This the it's right, flight it's radar's still it's glitchy. It's not your problem. It's not your problem. Exactly. Uh, we've got a jet two in front of us. There we go. That's going to uh, Izmir. Okay, cool. And just to say, coming down towards us now, we have a Ryanair Max. Yeah, that's going to be going to Dublin. And here's the Logan Air. I'm guessing this jet two is waiting for it to uh, arrive for... Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, it's notable that the windsocket where we are isn't moving half as much as the windsocket at the bottom end of the airfield where the planes are landing. But so to be, you know, very different conditions at the moment. Yeah, exactly. They're struggling a little bit.
Oh wow, that is a cold morning, David. But I, I hope you had a good day yesterday. Our coast to enjoy the coffee and the peace and quiet and relax. Absolutely. I wouldn't have blamed you just to have a nap, to be honest. You've been up since two. Oh, wowzers. So she's been up since two. Mm-hmm. Um, an unwell five months old. She had to take her other son to school. Yeah, it's not. Unfortunately, it's. It's what, what you have to deal with, isn't it? it is, but it's but never like, nice. It's never nice, though. Uh, little one's like having a sleep now. Of course, yeah. Is he, watching he's us? A, he's all, he, I'd be napping. He, he's done his thing now, hasn't he? He's, he's done like his a, thing. He's done his thing. He's like, going, oh, I've not been unwell now. I'm feeling a little bit... I'm going to get over it by having a good, good old sleep and everything. And then... Uh, well... Like I said, I, I just love my naps. But fair play to you for sitting down with us with a coffee. Oh no, I've got it at the wrong millimetre. Well, that is what you call a 900mm pan, people. <laughs> uh, not a problem, Mr. Pingu. Yeah, take care of yourself and say. Uh, oh no, I was just saying the email sent. Oh, okay. Yeah, Sorry, like I said, I don't know if I'll be able to reply today, but I'll. Uh, yeah, we've got a couple of days where we can get it yeah, done. Yeah, exactly. So, I will uh, get it done. We'll get. We'll definitely get back to you in the next day or two. Uh, do you know what? That's not bad for a 900mm pan, that. No, it was decent. I know, it was all right. I couldn't do a 900mm pan. I don't know many people that could do a 900mm no, pan. No, there's only a couple around there, to be honest. Well, there's you. I think, I think Simon can. Yeah. And MT Aviation. Yeah. Oh, uh, there's a couple Airborne Media could as well. Yeah, there uh, you go. And... Uh, oh, very nice guy as well. Oh, I forgot his name. Retweeted me yesterday. <laughs> uh, also, Rebecca? two free, two free left aviation. There you go. There we go. Oh, there's the Pilatus. It's in front. Yeah, there's there's a couple of uh, good ones out here. But as I say, uh, there's not that many. Oh, you should do Kirsty. Of course, yeah, it's Bank Holiday weekend this weekend, isn't it? Yes. The first of two. So, uh, if you're in the UK, and you. I was going to say, if you celebrate the bank holiday, <laughs> if you get the bank holiday off work is kind of what I meant to say. Yeah. I think everyone's going to be celebrating the bank holiday if they can. Oh, yeah. Um, that is this weekend. Hopefully, what's the weather looking like for that? Oh, Aegean's coming out in that nice livery. The what? Aegean. I thought you said the jeans are coming out in that nice livery. I, I like, thought you thought I said the Bee Gees are coming out and then I was like, going, that's <laughs> going to be a weird one. I know they're from Cholton, but you know. Uh, right, bank holiday weekend. Cloud, showers... Of course it Cloud. is. Uh, it's like 15 degrees. Oh, it's 17 on Saturday. Happy days. I'll Let's have a look. for. That's here. Let's look for more. BA yeah, is going on first. Let's uh, move on to uh, British Airways. Oh, well, I will take that. A320 Neo. Oh, sorry, I made a rookie error of just looking at the front of it and going, that's uh, an A320 Neo when it's not. I think there's a Ryanair from Venice either landing, about to land, maybe landed already. I don't care, I'll get 21 Neo. We'll get this A321 Neo going out. That's funny. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's a nice Russell should be coming out soon. Uh, right, hang on. Someone just said a virgin went over the house, so we should be with us soon, so I'm going to try and find it. If the flight radar works. Oh, flight radar, stop breaking again. What's coming in? A virgin Atlantic, maybe? Oh, it's the A350. I don't know where it's at. <laughs> I just know it's, it's not far away. <laughs> Uh, 
The flight radar gone down again. It's so. not I'm not using it. I can't. I can't use something that's unusable. Um, I'd rather have the glitchy thing rather than something that she. Yeah, so it's over Middleton at the moment. At least I know it's working. Yeah. And behind this uh, Iberia Express, we do have the Eugene A320neo. So, uh, oh, Jim, thanks for the 199 suitcase super sticker. Oh, we're going to be suitcasing it soon, mate. We are. Bong bing to you, lad. Bong bing. <laughs> France has just touched down. <laughs> oh, fair enough, Kirsty. Yeah, it wouldn't be a good idea to miss the school run, so hopefully we can keep you awake. <laughs> you can do it. I won't lie, if I could get a flight to Athens with on this, relatively yeah. cheap, because they do, do do some relative cheap flights, I'd be on that. I think Paul did it, didn't he? And he, just, he said he, he thought it was his best, the best short haul product out oh, there. Oh, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember now. I've lost track. <laughs> oh, thanks, David. Yeah, but, I mean, that is just the usual. Me chatting nonsense and Simon panning everything to perfection. It's just, it's just what we do. That's just normal. <laughs> normal for us. Right. This thing better not spill up while I'm doing this. <laughs> if it does, I'm going to look silly now that we've just said that. I think we need a bit of power in there. That's a shout. Sure, all the other wires are connected. We are good. Yeah, it's having a little bit of a wait here, isn't it, the Aegean? Oh, why not? And I can tell you the Virgin Atlantic turned on to finals. Oh, look at that, Matt. Not working a single Monday in May. We had three bank holidays plus uh, the other two Mondays in Cyprus. Well, houses. But uh, you might get me prowling, prowling around at Southside on one Sorry, of them. Sorry, everyone. Let's just jump up on this because I think. Oh, where is it? <laughs> there it is. We have a Lufthansa A340 flying over. Ooh. I love a bit of A340ness on this channel. Uh, it's uh, great to be able to catch that. Virgin Atlantic has just passed Stockport. Thanks, sir. So. 
Uh, we just had the EasyJet and the Europa car livery just uh, vacate in front of the runway visitor park. All right, yeah, Dean, just, uh, well, let Simon know if you're coming down. He's saying if the weather's nice, he might come down on the Monday. OK, let's stream somewhere else on Monday. Huh? What? Well, oh, right. <laughs> Sorry, I just got what you said. <laughs> on about <laughs> yeah someone's pulled the plug on flight radar again yeah it's gonna it, honestly it happens like I said the way they have to reconnect everything it's it's, it's interesting so uh, people don't I, I wouldn't I, if it if it was up running tomorrow properly I'd be somewhat shocked yes so uh, just bear with it I only yes. know how complicated it is because, like that 360 radar that I have on my uh, that I pay for, the developer is really, really good. He, uh, he there's like a, a Facebook page for it, and he goes through all the stuff that he has yeah. to do personally in order to get things sorted, and it's a lot. So I can't imagine what it'd be to have that infrastructure worldwide. There you go, Paul was saying about um, a G and flew from Athens to Manchester, ninety quid, and got a meal in economy. Yeah. got Wi-Fi as well, didn't you? Oh, it's there. Sorry. I lost it. Sorry, everyone, for that vicious pan, but um, I saw it and it has to be put on there. Sorry, it's, I, right. when you got glitchy things, it's... It's not even... It, I'm on the other one now, but... Um, it's glitchy, so it's, it's OK. Let's, it's not, well, it's to not, be honest, I don't, I'm not sure... No, it, that, that one was my fault. I'm okay. going to see if I can change the colour of the planes. Um, because they make the airport like a grey colour. Right. And I can't see a yellow plane on it. Well, don't worry about it. Well, we do have the uh, KLM in the uh, <laughs> Sky Team livery with the dodgy random coming over yeah, it. Oh, you love that. Oh, I'm, I'm going to go on to it now, because uh, whilst the light's good on that, well, let's uh, check this. I, I like, I, I think I've, I've told them I like KLM, and I think yeah. they're a really good airline, but please do something about that random. Maybe it's someone with a can of spray paint. Just get on it. Yeah. Uh, time here now, 11.38am. I feel like the talking clock when I say what time it is. Does the talking clock still exist? I mean, you just have to dial one, two, three. Yeah. The time sponsored by Accurist is 11.38 and 42 seconds. Precisely. <laughs> that was such a good um, rip off. Yeah. Thanks. Was that actually your job? Did you do the talking clock? Yeah. The secret's finally out. No. We're going to turn and burn here. Enjoy us. Let's follow that dodgy rando. Okay, I'll keep on this one. I didn't notice the 757 out as well. I just heard it. That's what that twitch on the camera was there. I just <laughs> naturally wanted to turn towards the 757. Uh, got free, he got free Wi-Fi for 15 minutes. Why, sorry? And that was on that gene flight. Oh, that's not bad. No, no. 
But yeah, we're, we're, we're not a fan of that nose. We need to sort the nose out. Yeah, sorry. Sort out the nose. Sort out the nose. Morning, Mandy. Like it's dunked its nose in a tin of paint. <laughs> Ooh, tomorrow land's coming out. Oh, there we go. At least you saw it this time. Oh, that one's going to get a record. I won't lie about that. It's a Dreamliner I can hear overhead. Air France, isn't it? No, it's... Um... Oh, it's an Air France one. It's an American Airlines from uh, oh, yeah. okay. Heathrow to uh, uh, Chicago, was it? an Air France near us as well. Ah, OK. An ATR from uh, an eight uh, Torini. Arini ATR is where I was meant to go with that uh, from Guernsey. It's uh, just approaching Hill Green. Well, I won't lie. I love the Arini, but I love this more. I'm, I'm pretty sure that advert I just had on that radar wasn't even British. Oh, flight radar. Oh, flight radar's on. Oh, thank goodness for that. <laughs> I'm going to go off again in a minute. You're gonna I do don't that. care. I'll use it while I can. Right, Arini. The end of the airfield. Oh, there, there it is there. Uh, cause Tomorrowland is waiting for it to uh, land so it can cross. at the arena <sighs> the pack emojis alright I'm all here for Tomorrowland that is what it's about I've said that when that uh, bra comes out I'll be going all about that as well yeah that's just because I'm a sellout Uh, it's got a Rhino on the way in from Bordeaux. That's a 737. Excellent. Now, do you want to bring it down this taxiway down here? I'm going to, I'm all for that. I mean, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? I think it's the only thing that there's the right thing to do. record it. Yeah, I will be recording it. Okay, let's see where the Emirates is. I think it's going straight well. down. Well, ugh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only kidding. No, uh, Nats have been amazing today uh, in sending oh, yeah. uh, the planes towards us. It's been fantastic. So, uh, I've had a lot of planes come down the taxiways in front of us, and it's been really, it's made for an amazing show, to be it honest. Has. Oh, there it is. There's the Emirates. Uh, 29 minutes away. It is, uh, it is over the UK. Excellent. It's uh, currently just passing. Uh, North Weald Airport, wherever on earth that is. South East somewhere. Right, I'm going to record. I'm just moving my microphone. I 
now I'm going to pan it. I'm not going to pan it on the pilots. I'm going to pan it on the eagle eye. so intricate when you look at it like there's a lot going on I will admit yeah I like that Paul's annoying because he keeps missing it that's why I like you Liz there's a lot going on <laughs> oh David did they have like was I was just assuming the talking clock was it sounds really bad like a British I guess it's because I was a child I wouldn't think of having the, the talking clock was like a worldwide phenomenon I think they needed to know the time all over the world. Yeah, no, that's very true. <laughs> well, just the UK thing. Wait a minute, I need to know what time it is. Well, I suppose back in the day we just had clocks and maybe sundials. Now we've just got the time everywhere. Uh, yeah, Billy's what I'd actually saw after a look where the Emirates was. And uh, I was like, oh, that's a weird airport. It's actually in Stansted, so it's... Uh, that is a weird airport now. Yeah, the other one I said, but everywhere, never mind. Uh, Victorian Transport Videos, good morning. So uh, I'm late, wasn't expecting a Wednesday night stream. Well, it's we are the... normally around on a Wednesday, but uh, I guess it's a nice surprise for you. Absolutely. All right, well, let's just go and put I just want to get an update of what's going in and what's going out myself. I'll be two seconds with this. Uh, Dean and I will pop it on the list because uh, I think we were saying so we got the bouncy bouncy one in but for the next emoji I don't know when we'll get the next one um, but we will do a, a poll. poll from members uh, I've just been trying to think of like which one's part on it but I've got a few ideas now and uh, bong bing that's coffee yeah. <laughs> one of the extra one of them I won't lie uh, Quasi, uh, welcome, new member. Thank you so much for signing up. Oh, brilliant! Thank you so that is much. That's amazing. We do appreciate that. Wait, what? Wait, when, 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 when did this thing go up? When did what go up? That. Got some crane work going on over there. Oh, sorry. Was that wasn't up earlier. Well, uh, no, I really appreciate. Uh, all our, our new members. We really do. It's fantastic to have so many new people uh, want to join the uh, channel. Absolutely. Where's the sunshine gone? I don't care. Oh, I don't know where that crane came where from. Where the crane came from. <laughs> well, I can't say where. Oh, I'm going to have to wait for the stream to catch up. I oh, think... here we go. Here we go. It's not small. Oh. Yeah, exactly. It's our side. That's really interesting. Uh I don't know. I think you need to know. Okay, just looking on flight radar to see what we've got. We do have a left. Uh, we don't. We have a ATR uh, 72. That's going to Belfast. It's Aer Lingus. Um, Lofty still pinging. But we have another Aer Lingus actually uh, from Dublin. And another ATR-72, that's on finals as we speak. There is an EasyJet A320neo that's just behind that, just flying from over Glossop as we speak. And of course we have to have a Pegasus A320 here oh, there as well, so uh, that'll be fun. I see Car Karen saying yes, so there, it's like the first stroke at the time will be like 10.27pm precisely. Did we have at the first stroke? Yes. Or, yeah, we did, but we had the time, I do remember that time sponsored by Accurist thing. Yes, we did, because ours, ours was sponsored by Accurist over here. Oh. Because accurate the timekeepers, weren't they? So they okay. were just like, if you want to be associated with the most accurate thing, let's do it with accurate. I see. Oh. Well, I'm not sure who else around the world they were, were going to be willing to sponsor that. It's like every major go uh, like golf tournament sponsored by Rolex, you know what I mean? No. They all like to be associated with... What, with overpriced watches? Uh, yeah. 
Liz just wants a Rolex. I don't. He do. Well, I went through... Uh... What are you doing? I saw, I saw a uh, hip flexor. Oh, right. You look like you're trying to kick a penalty. Liz, Liz, it's okay when you have to sit all during the stream on the... Some of us have to stand. It's painful sitting down. No, we'll stand I get a sore on. neck looking at my phone. Oh, well, stand up. <laughs> no, because then I get a sore arm holding my phone. Oh, <laughs> oh Singapore's coming out. That, did, that was on flight radar a minute ago. So flight radar's still not 100%. Right, what, what's coming out? Singapore 350. All oh, right. So Maybe uh, it just pinged up. It's on the taxi list. <laughs> Maybe it only just pinged up, but it, it was just really quick. Yeah. Maybe you're talking nonsense. That might that might be the one as well. Oh, so we've got the uh, got the bra coming out as well, which is a bit of a bonus. So the bra's coming out? Yeah, bra's coming out. Cool. Well, uh, it'd be nice to know that uh, we're the only ones uh, getting that south side today in the stream for you. And we know how much everybody loves prop. That's him. Oh, well, this is what I've been here for. Like, getting the A380 after this will be a mega bonus, but as I say... Uh... Oops, there is the other ATR. I'm sorry, I, we, we get the Airlinks ATR all the time. We don't want the bra. <laughs> We'll, uh... That's the one we want. We love that tail. That tail's awesome, isn't it? I think Bra have gone on to an absolute winner with that one. BRA? Whatever you want to call it. I'm calling it Bra because it sounds better. Yo, Bra. Oh wow, David, that sounds like the start of like a, a scary movie or something. <laughs> wow. I can't wait to see what that is in the chat <laughs> in a bit later. I don't know with this one, should I just do a, a pan on the tail? Because the front of it's like nondescript. Uh, oh, well, yeah, I guess so. I, I mean, it's whatever you want to do. It's your pan, babes. Wow. Thanks, Les. You're just <laughs> so helpful when it comes to making decisions like that. Uh, easy drive from P's, does it heal green? Uh, it's, oh. it's not getting touched. This I'm is... just saying. Right, I'm just going to record. It's holding short. But yeah, it looks really good. Well, that's good. And, uh, awesome, Crosby saying, uh, I have a few friends on the A380 coming. Excellent. Well, we're definitely there for that one. We are indeed. It's not too far away now, I don't think. And um, we had the Singapore A350. The, sing the, the Singapore? Singapore. It's, the, it's <laughs> close to the rate to the Singapore A350. And that's uh, that's about to cross runway one. 
That should be over here in no time. As I say, this uh, ATR will be uh, coming on to the active runway any minute now. <laughs> I won't lie, that's my favourite ATR. Wow. Such a bold statement. It's not bold, it's just true. That's nothing that comes close to that. That, that looks so good. <laughs> Some nice props on the bra. <laughs> oh dear. Right, I'm going to get this one as well. I don't think I've got a particularly good A350 turn on here. Right, we'll get this one. But uh, this one's going to rotate nice and early for us. Oh, wait. We do love an A350 departure here on the channel. Yeah, Singapore, you're going to have to wait because you're going to catch up with that ATR. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> Look how early that is. is that, where's that one going to? Oh, do you know what? I'd love to be able to tell you. Should we just go Singapore and make it up? Because it'll make it even sound. It'll make it sound even better. Yeah, let's just go to Singapore. Oh, the uh, power! Let, let me open the other one. So we have another ATR. Uh, no, nah, it's going to Houston. Oh, it's going. To, that's still impressive. It's still impressive. It's still mightily impressive how early these things can rotate. Yeah. They are absolute. Amazing. Beasts. Uh, I think David, if everyone just gets excited by the props, so they're like, just put loads of prop emojis. I don't think it's reflective of uh, that it's only got two, therefore two emojis. Uh, Smart Blue, no, the A380 is not here yet. Do you have the Pegasus touching down? <laughs> I'm going to stick with this right now because Liz really doesn't like him. Yeah. <laughs> so, do you know what? I think I'm going to rename that uh, bra prop. ATR to uh, Victoria's Secret. Yep. There we go. 
especially with a pretty tail. Oh, we've got double ATR action. Double ATRs? We've got Logan Air coming out as well. They're treating us today or what? Everyone in the chat must be loving this. I think they are, to be honest. Right, I'm going to look on the other app. Where's that there? Uh, no, that's not it. Is that it? There's the, uh, the Emirates. No, it's just, uh, <laughs> Emirates. just west of EMA. Awesome. Uh, Optimus Toaster, there are a few. Uh, Plane Finder, not one I'm recommending, but that's just my opinion. Uh, no, there's Plane Finder, there's uh, Radar Box, there's... ADSB. ADSB. There's a couple others that I know other people have mentioned, which I've now forgotten what they're called. Oh, I'll tell you what, this one can make a bit of noise for us. It's A321neo. See what it does. Right, it's going to be loud. A bit of whale mating. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, let's let's pan the engine. Let's pan the engine. That's what we're going to stick on. Uh, thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Uh, I'll just say the dogs. I won't read the rest of that just because uh, I wouldn't say it's particularly family friendly. There we go. That's the word I'm looking for. <laughs> yeah, wasn't that way? Really, really. No, it wasn't. At this point, we'll still pan the engine. is taxi on, so we'll go on to that. So this one's an Aer Lingus. I'm going to be guessing it's going back to... Is this one Belfast one, this one? Uh, oh, sorry, were you asking me? Yeah, that's a question. Sorry. Um, you say Dublin, aren't you? Uh, Belfast. Belfast, okay. Okay, cool. Now we've got Logan Air behind it. Double propage. Enjoy, everyone. And next to the part will be the Ryanair, not Logan Air.
Oh, yes, yeah, Sarah, we muddle through. We can just guess where things are going or try and use the other apps. <laughs> yeah, just make it up. This one's going to uh, Guadalajara. <laughs> yeah, OK. Uh, With props. No, no, the Logan Air's going to... Um, oh, sorry. No, 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 the Ryanair's going to Guadalajara. Oh, right, OK, yeah. The Ryanair's going to Boston Logan, so it's going to go and see Sarah. It's a different Sarah, but all but right. okay, oh, I don't care. I was going to see the other Sarah then. I was going to go and see the other Sarah <laughs> in uh, Boston. Oh, God. That's how far ATRs can fly now. <laughs> Matt saying, Flight Radar 24 20, uh, Flight Radar 24 tweeted, they're investigating why there's no planes. <laughs> right now it's like going oh is it taking so long and easy it's just touch down behind it but I'm not bothering panning that because I'm lazy yeah so what they've actually tweeted now says they're investigating an intermittent issue with ADSB data display yeah so they're, 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 I don't think that they used to rebooting the servers and it's totally understandable is not it when everything's working right it's great <laughs> A couple of things go wrong and well you know what it's like it's like with our stream you know like you know if you miss out on a bit of internet everything goes down exactly so uh Uh, no, James, we'd have a good discussion about um, <laughs> no, bread don't. and ketchup as well. Yeah. No chippy today, though. Well, the uh, Emirates A380 is about to turn on to finals. Awesome. Oh, it's in the 50th year livery. Is that, no, it can't be. That's, that, they got rid of that ages ago. That picture's dead old. <laughs> yeah, well, it's, well it's just, I, I know. <laughs> Sorry, do you know I'm what? Using another app, I'm using another app. I know. Do you know what? I looked on Flight yet. Radar before because I saw that. Yeah, it's, uh, it, And I double checked it. It's, it's not, not. It's a it's normal not, one. It's normal livery. It's about to say the 50th went ages ago. Now, I would have loved it to be the 50th, because that would have been really good in this light, but... Now, that, that's got to be another 0.5 taken away off that app, plane finder app, Liz. Yeah, exactly. <coughs> <coughs> Having me. old photos is not an excuse. Wow, the heat haze at the bottom of the runway is crazy now. I bet. I'm going to get turning better, peeps. Enjoy. Oh, David, I'm agreeing with you. I uh, I think sometimes the planes need to shut up because no one can hear me talk. Oh, God, no. I please. can't be having that. No, we need more planes. <laughs> the louder the better. <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, anyone wants How to... How can I tell people to put salad cream on lasagna if there's loads of planes make, like just talking over me? Well, not oh. talking over me. Making noise call? over me. Hi there. Any any operator with the 767400 uh, <laughs> want to come over here? We will love you. Hashtag make Liz quiet. <laughs> uh, see you later, Mr. Fingy. Thank you for joining today. Have a great rest of your Wednesday. Yeah, totally. We say our last uh, arrival is not too far away now. Awesome. Uh, this this big ugly biz jet <laughs> is uh, it's going to be a, probably our last departure. Unless it doesn't shift and then it's just getting the A3. Oh, no, we're going to be getting to Singapore. That's going to be our last departure. Okay. That's just that's coming out the back now. Awesome. Uh, that one will be going to Singapore, I imagine. Yep. Yep, so that one's working out. So the A380 is actually uh, near Cheadle, so uh, I, I don't care about this thing, do you? Does anyone really care? 
No, I think I think we all want the A380. Beers jet, beers jet, beers jet, beers jet. I think it's an Austrian. Oh, it's an Austrian red, Liz. Yay! Does that mean you want to see it more? I can go over to the A380 from over in two seconds from there, so it's not a problem. I know it's quite close. Oh yeah, the, that that thing's definitely waiting for the A three eighty. Okay, let's go. Cool. Let's go. Oh, I got that one wrong, didn't I? Well, I'm gonna wait for the A three eighty. Sounds like a plan. I had enough of a little biz jet action today. I had enough of biz jets. Well, no, we don't like biz jets. Just, just little one. A380 is in sight now. I hope you enjoy this, everyone. It's going to be our last arrival, but we will be getting the uh, Singapore A350 that is about to uh, go out. So look at those epic engines. I'll tell you what, this A350 is on the move. No messing around with Singapore What's today. What's like? Oh, sorry, Bev. I think Greg's is a call in, though. We can't stay all day. Yeah, it's the Greg's life for us. The Craig's <laughs> oh, what should I have today? So my usual options are uh, either a chicken bake, oh, a vegetable bake, a cheese and onion bake. See, when I, I, I'm going the in there, I kind of know what I'm going to have straight away. I'm just like, yeah, no nonsense. Well, it just depends kind of what takes my fancy. I might go for a vegetable today. If got right, okay, she's ordered a vegetable already. She's not, like, reneging on that now. Yeah, I think it might be a vegetable day, won't I? Oh, he's turning left. Oh, like, would this be a great show just to end if it came on this taxiway right in front of us? Love that. That would just be the show for me. I would just like going, all right, that's it. We're done. We are never streaming again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Paul is saying, uh, thanks for your company whilst I have been doing uh, one of those little DIY jobs. Uh, that's taking me two plus hours. Surprised you didn't hear the cursing. <laughs> I, I think we did. I thought I wonder what that noise was before. I thought it was it rustling. Was, I yeah, thought it was I thought rustling. it was a robin in the trees, but no. <laughs> oh, and I also thought it could have been like an streamer going down. I don't know. I, I, I heard a few things, but um... <laughs> now we know. Now we know. It was you. I, I think this has to be my favourite um, Singapore because it's named after MT Aviation, who's my, one of my favourite. YouTubers, oh, it's, it's coming down here. <laughs> what a way to finish this show. This is going to be amazing, people. Yes. Enjoy this. Yes, as you probably imagine, we are going to be taking the mics off for this one. But this Don't is... want any rustling. No rustling, because this is going to be epic footage. It better not be going back to stand. <laughs> Just go for a tour. <laughs>
I'm just hold in there for a second, but how amazing does this look? Can't beat it, can you? We have been a very, very lucky today, and we've got to say thank you to the amazing staff at Nats in the Tower, who have, uh, I don't know if they know, but we think they're amazing, but they've really helped us today. They've made our show just another level. Absolutely. They all do a fab job. They do. And as we keep saying on our show, they are actively looking for new uh, staff to train at the moment. So definitely get on the Nats website, have a look, try the tests out. They do aptitude tests as well, just to see how you might feel about doing some of the you know the kind of procedures that you'll be doing if you uh, are taking on the course. I might try doing another one of them. Are you sure? Like yeah, even if you know, you, you should f- film that for behind the scenes. That'd be hilarious. Oh wow, that actually could be good fun. Um, <laughs> sure, that's I'd love that. But as I say, it, it's well worth it. And if you ever wanted to do it, it's cool. They also do have like positions at Manchester for uh, assisting the uh, ATC at the moment. There is one, I think. Uh, well, there's the only one that I've seen advertised. So, you know, if you fancy it, go for it. Nothing to lose. I feel like I do across the wing thing. Hang on a sec. Well, I think this is the best way to finish any show. I'm so happy that we're going uh, a little bit longer. Yeah, absolutely. It's a good good idea to stick around. Yeah, I, I, we weren't going to. I, well, I won't lie. When we turned up today, we weren't going to be here that all that long. We didn't think we were going to be here that all that long. No. But uh, you got your head got turned by an ATR. <laughs> I got corrupted by an ATR. You never thought you'd hear that, would you? No. First time for everything, people. There is a Logan Air coming over here. I'm just going to tell you flat out now, I'm ignoring that. <laughs> I'm, I'm here for this. I'm not going to lie, I wish I had my camera. You were there today, like, oh, you won't need your camera today. Yeah, sorry <laughs> about that. Oh, well. You always get still from this, though. Well, no, it's just as good, isn't it? 50 megapixels, boom, it's a still. You can't go wrong with that. There's an air transat coming out, right? So I will, if that goes in before this, I will film that. Yeah. But as soon as I get the sense of that Singapore's moving, I'm back on that like a shot. Let's go right in on the flight deck. Let's see if we can get uh Those pilots look so diddy in that plane. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> As I say, the Logan Air can go. Um, I'm not going to be filming that. Exactly, Bev. We're not going until this is gone, so, you know, stay it around. Can, it Stick can be around. 10. 15 minutes. I want this. Yeah, exactly. It's the uh, flying sewing tin decided to push in front. Oh, thanks everyone for uh, who's pressed that like button today. Yeah, we really do appreciate that. It's next level. Yeah, I can't believe it's 20 past 12. No, I know, it's crazy, isn't it? Well, we started early as well. We started like 10 minutes early. We were like, oh, like... Just got a bit shorter today. <laughs> no, no, that's not going to happen, is it? Is that not, about Manchester having fun. Okay, so the uh, the Air Transat is is holding. So I'm I'm guessing this is going to be going next. Month. You'd imagine. You'd imagine so. I can't see anything else that's going to be coming over here in the next few minutes. But I'm, I'm not, they're obviously waiting for a slot. Oh. Well, 
I mean, there's worse views to have. I, uh, yeah, I, I, I'd agree with that. Oh, is he waving? You know, that guy was, I think there's a wave out of the left side of the plane there. And the captain? That air transit's coming on first. So I will get that, but as I say, once I get an, an, an inclination that this uh, A350 is going, <laughs> I'm going to be back off it. <laughs> yeah, Karen is just posing. <laughs> No, he's, he's, no, he's looking in really good in 4K. Not exactly. So this is going to be a poor pan, I won't lie, because I'm just going to be watching Singapore. Well, that worked out well. It did. There we go. Enjoy this, everyone. Well, what a way to finish a show. Oh, that, it doesn't get better than that. Don't care where you are. That was absolutely bonkers. So thank you for hanging around with us, if you did. Um, it, that was well worth it. Absolutely. Uh, I just want to big, say a big shout out to everyone in that tower right there. Absolutely amazing. Love you to pieces. Yes, I know you we probably do. don't even know what you're doing, but you made our show brilliant. Yes. So uh, thank you to everyone, like I say, who's viewed, who's uh, joined as a member, who's subscribed to the channel, liked the channel, uh, donated money kindly to us today. That's been absolutely amazing. It's been awesome. It's been Mods, nice. you've been fantastic. As always, as you're always. absolute rocket. So thank you for your amazing support. Uh, Liz, thank you so much oh, for your you. time. And let's go and get a Greg's. Yay, thanks, Diamond. Thanks there for your go. amazing pans, the best pans ever. Well, you know, one, one does try. One does try. Um, I actually forgot to get the uh, laptop off to uh, shut the stream down. Yeah, there. that would help, wouldn't it? Yeah, it but, uh, no, it's been amazing today. We're going to obviously. Oh, I a bit tired. oh, I just heard myself. I don't want to hear that. Yeah, no one wants to hear but that. yeah, we'll be back uh, by the weekend, I guess, won't yeah, we? On Sunday. We'll on be Sunday, at. yeah. Bright and early. But uh, take care, everyone, and we'll see you again soon. Yeah. See ya. Bye, yeah. Bye, bye, yeah. Bye, bye. I don't even know what you're on about. <laughs> bye, I need food. <laughs> there we go. <laughs>